What is up, gamers? My boys, welcome to the stream. Sugar Daddy, uh, Abdella, Zivone, Icy, SPH, uh, Yada, Fuel. What up, y'all? How we doing? Tell this is gonna be a W stream. It's gonna be heat. Damn, the hair is looking actually not bad today. What the fuck? Considering how it looked yesterday, I'm actually kind of balding. I don't think there's any reason for my hair to look so good. I woke up and the bonnet was off too. All right. I actually, I'm not going to look gift horse in the mouth. This is fine. Will you push for Zenith? Hell no. Three Ps. What up, man? Welcome to the stream. If you guys are just coming in, hey, y'all hit that like button. Pretty please. Cherry's on top. We are going to hit up some, some bashing quests is the, uh, is the play here. It is time. It's time for the Bastions, boys. I want to say I can get to four? Is the highest I can go? Yeah. Oh! We can go higher with uh, with 20. Which is probably a decent idea, right? We want to go to 20 before um, for the other one. So, Alright, so let's get four, four, level up bar reports, maybe? And then we come back to bring this to 20, I think. When are you joining the main alliance? I'm in the main alliance. What up, Flex? How you doing? Any coaching today? Um, I, there's like an alliance event at 16. Um, I don't know. Maybe. I will see. Let's see who's open right now for coaching. <sighs> wow, what the hell? See what's going on here. Oh, did they fix the Xena skin? Oh, they made it look good? Okay, good. I was about to say, because the Xena skin looked pretty bad last time. Did they make it look better? Ah, apparently they upgraded the Xena skin, so now it's pimped out. That's based. Yo, it's a good time to be alive when 12's back to back stream. What up, Mike? How you doing, man? Is it coffin? Zyking jumping tips? I'd be checking out uh logic bank for that you think i'll ever be chaining with seven marches i'd have to unlock seven marches and then chain with them so probably not six perhaps though <sighs> we'll see we'll see what i can do uh coaching sash We ping some people. We'll see if we can do... I'll do one session. Uh, your hair looks good today. Thank you so much, Sugar. I appreciate it, man. Uh, who do you think the Zenith is going to be good for? Uh, probably like Garrisons. Garrisons, Siege players, stuff like that. Today we had... Uh, what do we have today? We had two bananas today. So our, um, our overall food intake has been rather low. I'm planning on eating, I think I'm going to eat like a pound of chicken breast, uh, after my halfway point. Something like that. Azure, what up, man? How you doing? Let me eat your hair and see if it's up to standards. Thank you. Thank you for the offer. I'll have to take this under serious consideration.
I'm glad they're I'm glad they're changing the Zenith, bro. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, the Zenith is rough. That was a uh, not my favorite Zenith skin ever released. Doing good in you. Uh, I'm doing all right. I talked to Lilith last night. Um, I was offered a raise. Uh, it was not the raise I was hoping for, but it was it was a raise. It is strictly more money than I was making previously. So I will I will have to I will have to you know, I'll have to go pick pick that up. I guess. Sorry. Better than no raise to Pog True. For some reason, your hair uh, makes me uh, feel like eating instant noodles. I had, I did have ramen yesterday. I had uh, the peanut butter ramen, which is really good. I actually hadn't had it in a very long time. Um, I had it in my in my nice uh, Panamanian China, which was which was based. It was cool. It was uh, it was it was yummy, dude. I was so tired last night, dude. I I started stream so late. Holy shit. I, cause I think I, I, I cut stream. It had to be like 1230 or like one. And then I cooked and then I went to sleep at like two. I woke up at 630 and I could not go back to sleep. I was like, fuck dude. And I was like, oh, I should just stream again. But I had to do some other shit, uh, having to do on stream. Cause I, um, I thought I was on the RR team. I guess I, I was not, I was, <laughs> I was talking to him and I was like, I was like, yo, I was like, Hey, I was like, uh, I signed up for art this week and I'm not registered. And he's like, yeah, you're, you're not on the team. And I was like, like we thought <laughs> what are you talking about i'm playing on this team for like three months he's like no no no, you're not on the team and i was like all right okay i'll just i'll just be here i was like i didn't need those sculptures anyway i was like 10 sculpts i was like i'll just i'll just go fucking cry i was like i'll just go sob in the corner it's cool i'm, I'm just gonna go ball my eyes out what's up scorpion welcome if y'all are coming in, hey, please hit that like button, my boys. Really helps a ton. All right. I'm trying to think, how many marches do I want for this? Uh, so I have to do 25 forts in three hours. So do I want four marches for that? God damn! All right, let's get Duke. Pop for the top guns in your kingdom, AOO. I, I mean, true. Actually, hold up. Fuck, I forgot I had to, uh, I wanted to apply for a while, too. I almost forgot. Now that we're, now that we're like 90 mil, bro.
Oh shit. Uh, what's in here? 132. All right. Okay. Sorry, I'm doing the, the OL team survey right now. Uh, top guns in your kingdom. Allied with 89, haven't kept up. Yup, this is my fourth time allying with them, third time in a row. Mr. Michael, I started working my infantry march, second after cab. I expertise LC, but I'm hesitating to pair with Scipio or Gorgo to save sculptures for the cab. I only have cab T5. I pair Scipio. Do you have enough cab marches for OL? Um, I have one. I mean, I don't, you'll be like joining rallies and shit, so I'm, they don't need like all of these on the field. Um, okay, 19209 uh, plus. Okay. All right, so what's in here? Okay. Uh, one, one. Three, two, two, nine, three. Okay. And then we're going to add this on to one, oh, one, one, six, oh, eight, two, six, seven. Okay. Okay. And then nine, three, nine, six, oh, two. Always. Yes. Okay, Alex, I'll see Scipio. Uh, Theodora, Trajan, Heracles, Honda. Oh, I don't have any of these. Say Frederick, I guess. Sheesh! All right, I'll be uploading the rest of this later, I guess. Oh my God, this is a lot. <clears throat> Did you migrate? Nope, I'm still in uh, 13, uh, 13, 1365. Um, all right, Duke, I would like Duke. Each time, each time we get the event, it stacks. Okay, only 100k, we'll send an announcement. Okay, so we're, we're doing 100k each. It's not bad. All right, so this should go by pretty fast. Let's see, do we get any coaching clients? <clears throat> nope. Okay, cool. All right, based. Um, hope your morning is doing well. Yeah, it's not too bad. Uh, Steven, Boudicca is so ass pain to admit it, but yeah, I would not invest in Boudicca anymore. Steven, welcome to the stream. Glad to have you here. Goodbye. What's up, man? How you doing? Lampies, welcome. Glad to have you here as well. If you guys don't mind hitting the like button, I'd appreciate it a lot. Do you think unlocking T5 is easier or harder than the time you did? Probably easier. The more events that are released, the easier it gets. Welcome, Coco. Farm Barbarians, Peacekeeper. Hey, what up, Crispy? Glad to have you here. Quick question. I'm new and I jump on Alliance on Tuesday. 190,000 power. Quickly increase it. Yeah, it's going to be City Hall and, and Commanders. City Hall and comms, big boy. That's going to be the uh, the schmoove. All right. 
Feel free to, to give me um feel free to give me the uh the, the Duke voice. Uh we're missing 3k actually. Let's see if I can pick that up uh from Trial of Kalkarak. Ah, let's go! Alright, based. Alright, Duke, feel free to, to pop up anytime now. Don't forget to leave a like and comment so we can get a better deal with Lilith. Well, tough. Tough, 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 tough. Okay, we don't have Duke yet, which is unfortunate. Um, hey, thanks for the sub, man. I appreciate it. What's up, freaks? Welcome to the stream. Glad to have you here. What do you mean tough? I was being nice for once. No, no. Oh, we already got it. Sorry, I didn't know if I, I told you. Yeah, we are. We already uh, finished it. We did, we are getting a raise, which is good. Oh, I forgot to put it on my YouTube here. Is that me? That is not me. Love the videos you're putting out, 12. Keep up the good work. Hey, thank you, much, Steven. I appreciate it. What up, Sword? Welcome to the stream. How you doing? How long are you live today? I'm live for four hours in this session. I'll be live for another four hours next session. Oh, man. They're asking me for a bunch of screenshots of everything. Fucking tough. All right. Alright, um, let's see, paint, open, um, man, I hate that uh, Google Drive requires you to add files, let's see, so I have to make like a new like OL file in my pictures, okay, uh, Osiris League 2024, fuck, that's not it, cancel, uh, OL 2024, Save as. Uh, March one year. Okay. Then we'll have this. This is going to be uh, March two year. Oh shit, I'm being an idiot. Okay, I'm being I'm being really dumb. Alright, so this is gonna be March 2 gear. We're gonna put this one on the Okay, so this one goes into OL and we're gonna call this oh. 
There's March 2 gear. March 1 gear. Straight in the OL bucket, yeah. Okay. Okay, boys. Okay, and then... Let's see. Do we not have anything equipped for the, uh... For him? Ah, okay. Cool. Okay, March 3 gear. Let's go into arms. Okay, let's see where we're at. Okay. Okay, let's see. So this is going to be arm 3. One year. Okay, and then where's our last one? Who's asking for those screenshots? Uh, they are my, uh, it's my kingdom. They're having an OL submission, so I'm trying to, trying to submit is what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to see if I can, I can sneak my way into, into so OL, ideally. Um, yeah, I think it'll be, I think it'll be hype. I really, I mean, I liked OL the first time I did it. Um, I think I'll like OL again. Pretty sure anyway. Fairly certain. Probably not my best arms and shit, but yeah. Okay, the first one I have is Zeal Herman, so. Okay, let me put that in. And then equipment for gear two is gonna be my imp stuff. Armaments for gear two is gonna be my imp stuff. My equipment is going to be boom. And... Uh, okay. All right, nice. Man's got an early stream, you already know. Is it, hey, what is up, boys? Welcome to the stream. Uh, BT, <laughs> All right, boom, the response is done. The response is done and we are back. I'll just once again view what we're doing. Oh, uh, it is uh, Duke time. 
Back to bullying uh, Tov it is. Hey, been watching your lives. Push T5 so I'm going to save my account. Nice. What is up? I slap fat kids. Sabin, welcome. Glad to have you guys here. Hey, please hit the like button if y'all are just coming in. Chihuahua, Ray Ray, Ape. What's up, man? How you doing? Putting on Mom Bumble. Is it rare for a DC in KVK3 to be stronger than some of the BNCs? Uh, yes. Definitely not common. Man's got that early stream. We already know, Kirby. Should I use the YSG behind Herman Prime or ZL? Um, Herman Prime or ZL need to be their own march, I think. If you put this 100 mil power on Bumble, the chicks would fly in. Uh, I believe I did that at one point. It didn't work. So. Duke on you. Yeah, I saw. Oh, well, it's gone now. All right. Well, tough. I was, uh, I was busy submitting for, uh, for OL. Doing my OL submissions. Uh, wait a minute. Rip my, my Arca Rosaris. Jesus Christ. So sad. Did 1316 change their mind? Will fight or no word? I have no idea. Nor do I care if I'll be an honest, bro. <laughs> Let's go. These always have AP. Um, I'm not going to open the AP until later because I want to be able to gem some AP. But uh, heat. All right. So I only have to do 25. And let's see. How's life? Uh, been better, been worse, big dog. It is what it is. Okay, so are we gonna be doing shit in Judge too? Because Judge is in our in our alliance. Um, we have three hours. So that's like quite a lot. Um, quite a lot of time. So uh, let's see. I think three marches should be fine. Three marches at 100k each. Um... I only have to do 25, so. Tulsa's BTSD from seeing the judge tag? Too real. Too real. Uh, he's not wrong. Those are uh, the judge days. Uh, not, not the most epic. Trinity, what up, man? Got YSG expertise. Should I hurt fast and Herman Prime or ZL? Um, probably Herman Prime first and then ZL after. What do you think? Is Nevsky Scipio a good march? I'll quickly run out of inf. Maybe I should pair them up. No, it's awful. What up, Leo? How you doing, man? Welcome to the stream. Glad to have you here. If you guys are just coming in, y'all, please hit that like button. I'd appreciate it a whole lot. Take but a second of your time, and by God, it helps a shitload. Okay? Helps a ton. Mm-mm-mm. All mm right. Jesus Christ. Um, okay, cool. Let's go. Let's march. And I want to see, did we do all of our state forum stuff? Yeah, we did. Uh, okay, Lyceum. Boom. Celtic Rose is going to be Boudica. I have a dream is going to be Martin Luther King. Marco Polo. The Red Chameleon. What is the primary cause of Karst landform? Sorry. Dissolving action of uh, water. Okay. Oh, the Olympic Games. Uh, Sao Paulo? It took place in 
No, Sao Paulo and Rio de Janeiro. I'm, I'm bringing it right now. That's crazy. All right. Well, that's tough. That's sad. Apparently, they had games in, in many of the cities. I'm so sad. All right. Um... Oh, I still got the thing though. Okay, cool. It's awful. Why? Because you don't mix troops. Nevsky Scipio? Yeah, just put Nevsky Jump. Or put Scipio with something else. Who would win in a fight? A roided up silverback gorilla or a polar bear? Um, I think the silverback, right? The silverback might actually rip the polar bear in, in like in half. Um, silverbacks are really strong. Jamie, uh, Jamie, can you, Jamie? You pull up that uh, that video of a silverback uh, ripping a bear in half. Where's my duke? I'm five on the duke list. Holy shit. Are people pushing duke really hard? I'm trying to figure out why duke is so contested. We, we have Zenith in like a day, right? What is the, what is the Lord of War at? Mm, I'm confused. Herman Prime is fieldable uh, over a 5551 Boudica. Probably like a 5511, I think. SQ, what up, bro? How you doing? Should have asked me first, noob. What is up, boys? Hey, thanks for the sub, Dan. Appreciate it, man. Oh, with the artifact? Oh, it's probably fine then. Gotta the polar bear. A polar bear weighs a thousand pounds. Oh. A polar bear can lift 1,540 pounds. A silverback gorilla can lift 1,780 pounds. So the gorilla is stronger than the polar bear. It's just smaller. I'm just saying like the, the, the gorilla like pretty, I, I want to say the gorilla like reps the polar bear's weight. Also, what the fuck? A gorilla can lift over four times its body weight? That's disgusting. That's actually abhorrent, bro. Polar can smell your blood through a foot of ice. I, I don't know what that has to do with fighting, really. It does sound scary, though. Peep the shirt. Hey, what up, Eve? How you doing? Ah, uh, yes, we are, uh, we have the, uh, uh, I've actually never watched this movie. Um, but I've been told that I look like the guy, so... I called it a day and, and just picked it up. 12 comparing animal deadlifts. I, I feel like it's relevant here. Look, this is a rock stream, okay? We're scientists here. Stronger in a lifting sense, polar bear swipe has more power than grizzlies punch that they can't really punch like a human can. I have no fucking idea, bro. I'm not gonna pretend. I'm not an expert on this. I think, me think gorilla punch hard. Kill polar bear. Okay. What's what's my what's my source? What's my evidence? I made it the fuck up. Okay, okay, y'all, strap in. I invented it. They fight on water and land. Those are the important questions. Who cares, bro? Honestly, I think a silverback gorilla is like the Goku of the animal kingdom. I didn't get big arms with that equipment. I want to do the same. I don't know if I would say my arms are necessarily big. I mean, they're okay. Um, I would say... I, I mean, diamond push-ups really, like, did it for me. Push-ups and diamond push-ups just did a shitload. God damn, my hair is looking... Why is it looking so fire today? What did I do? How did I do this? Dude, I have to... I have, they, uh, this must be studied. I woke up with this. I don't understand. How do I get this before I go out in public? How do I make this happen?
Do those do like Hulk, Hulk smashes? True. Battlestar Galactica? <sighs> oh shit, how deep are we in the in the Duke queue? Oh, oh, uh, we're about to, we're about to scoop. About to be Duke time for us. Cooking one in a cup, uh, one, a cup and a half of raw rice and a pound of chicken. Nice. What the fuck? Are you eat that in a sitting? Alright, I should be getting Duke any second now. <clears throat> should be should be Duke time. There we go. All right, and that is it, I'm pretty sure. <clears throat> Let's do the Battles and Lost Canyon real quick. Um... And let's see if we can pick up anything else. Because there could be a chance that we do the Lost Canyon Battles and they immediately drop us another... Um... We could do the Lost Canyon Battles and they immediately drop us another uh, training quest. Unlikely, but not impossible. Nope. 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 Alright. Very base, very epic. Um, defeat a Kahar the Hidden? I can do that. Aha! I have to return my boy home, though. We'll do that next. Let's go to War of Conquest. Oh, it's Will the Ancients. Okay, cool. Alright, that should be it. Cool. Um, the rice is what gets you. Um, two sittings, your body can't digest that much chicken properly. You should have two thirds of the protein. That is true. <clears throat> the pants at light snack. <sighs> Francis Naganu or Anthea Joshua? I have no idea. I don't look. Uh, what up, 13 inch? P mid, welcome. I just shot you on a beer before I leave to work. Thank God it's Friday. Jesus Christ. What do you think of 2605 disbanding? I'm sad, bro. You know, I, I, I never, you know, I mean, I no, I don't think I'm ever preying on anybody's downfall. So, it's unfortunate that that ended like that for them. I, you know, did they talk a lot of shit? Yeah, but that is what it is. Peed on a homeless man today? I think of August, August, Jesus. Digestive Justinian. Francis is a monster? True. How does Canyon Class work? Canyon Class. Oh, Canyon Clash? I truly have no idea. I don't know. I've been paying attention. I, I've not. I've not given a shit about Sunset or Lost Canyon in a long time. What is up, Prince? How you doing? Rip uh, Toriyama. Yeah, for sure, bro. Rip. Hey, big big ups to, to the boy Toriyama. Very very sad to see him go, but you know, kind of is what it is. 
By the way, if you guys are just coming to the stream, please hit that like button, y'all. I'd really appreciate that a whole lot. Dragonite, what's poppin', man? How you doing? What's good? Uh, you know, hey, we're just chilling out here. Relaxing, about to do a uh, little, little uh, alliance quest, and yeah, that'll be about it. Damn. That's 224,000 power for a few quests. It's kind of crazy how casually I can push that, right? Like, those are... Like, the vast majority of those speeds were chained. Crazy. Ugh. What do I want to eat today? Oh, yeah, yeah, I have chicken in the fridge. I guess I can make rice, too. Should I just make, like, a regular rice and chicken? I mean, with the extra chicken I have? We'll see. What's the next account roast you want to take your soul? That sounds... gay. I don't know if you are aware of how gay that sounded, but that sounded pretty gay. And that's coming from me, okay? I end every stream with saying love you guys in a gay way. I mean, I fuck with the vision. I'm just saying. I just, I just yeah. Do you get sad if you miss out on an event rock? Yes, pissed me off a lot, actually. A lot. I missed, like, four Ark of Osiris's in my entire playtime. I'm about to miss, uh, this is gonna be my fourth, actually. Uh, and that shit annoys the hell out of me. Eats fat kids for post-workout. Don't make it gay. It's already gay. I need your opinion. White air fa forces or white air maxes? Uh, why not just black air forces? Oh, why white? Let's see. Let's see what the difference is. All right. I'm be honest, boys. I have no sense of style. So let's, uh, let's look. Uh, honestly, this is the type of shoe that a bad bitch would wear. Yeah, I mean, yeah, y'all know what I'm talking about, like the those bad uh, Latina bitches with the with the huge eyelashes. They be wearing these, and the uh, what's it, the Lava Sevens or whatever. All right, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go the solid neither, bro. I, I'm gonna be so honest with you, so real, a hundred percent. These remind me of women's shoes. And again, it's not like men can't pull off women's shit. I'm just saying, you know, this is, these are shoes that I would see a bad bitch in. Uh, and it makes me, I, I don't know how to decide because I don't know, you know. Bro, these shoes, these shoes, this was the, this is the bad bitch special, bro. I would see, I would see the, the baddest bitches ever in these shoes. When I was in high school, bro, this, this was the, these were, these were, these were flame on flame. Dude, it'd be a chick with a just spectacular body. And then she'd wear these bitches every time. Um, dude, I, a whole array of chicks in my school that I can think of wearing with these shoes. These were, these were, these were the bad bitch Chicana Chola shoes, bro. What'd you eat last stream? Uh, I had, um, I had, uh, uh, peanut butter ramen. Let's eat. Asking 12 on, uh, fashion devices. Yeah, true. I want to take your soul. Hey, what up, Bakil? How you doing, man? Glad to have you here. White Air Forces. They look sick. Said my comment was gay. Didn't answer the question. I wear those. Asking 12 for fashion advice is the first mistake. That is true. I have no fashion advice. You bad bitch. Men's orgasming over shoes that women wear? Okay, I'm not orgasming over the shoes. I'm orgasming over the fucking women. What? How did? How is that one not obvious? This man, this man heard me call a woman a bad bitch. And he's like, he's like, he's like a bad bitch. He must've been talking about the shoes. <laughs> okay, I see where your priorities are, Trinity. I don't, I get, I, hey, different strokes. Bad girls wear Doc Martens. Yeah. I remember my ex wore Doc Martens. Not, not Tat. Uh, Dan the Man. Dan the Man wore Doc Martens. Peanut butter ramen, please explain. It's like, uh, it's like a, a ghetto pad thai. Hola, que pasa, Camilo? Bienvenido directo. Un gran saludo también a todos mis hispano hablantes. How we doing today, boys? Tatted piercing girls will ruin you. Wear them Dr. Martens. Yeah, it'd be like that. We all know 12 loves and shoulders. Well, I, I, I had to stop. I had to stop. They, they were hurting my feelings, bro. They 
They hurt my feelings and they were hurting me. Okay, I'm just a gamer out here. Just a gamer out here with feelings. Yeah, maybe this stream will be a little extra because I can't pop the uh, expansion yet. Maybe I'll just do some. Maybe I'll do some streaming. I'm not sure. Twelve's a feet lover confirmed. Thank you, Gren. I, I appreciate it. What are your thoughts on jet black trench coats? Um, bro, I knew I knew a chick that used to wear um used to wear like the trench coat, and I was like, yo, I was like, I was like, what the fuck? Why? I was like, why are you doing this? I mean, like, it, it didn't look bad on her. I was just like, I was like, bro, I was like, you look like a school shooter. <laughs> Too many tunes. Welcome to the stream. Glad to have you. Now it's Crocs, dude. Platform Crocs. That used to be my uh, my Bumble bio. If you if you wear platform Crocs, hit my uh, hit me up. Finn, what up, man? How you doing? Now I need to try it. Any ramen specific? It'd be chicken ramen. Chicken ramen. I do uh, PB protein powder. I do uh, hot sauce, lemon, uh, and then sometimes I'll throw in like cilantro and onion and stuff. Uh, sometimes I I season it a little extra with. Um, uh, non-salt seasonings and like pepper and paprika as well our enemies surrender before kl so now i can't get to one bill hey it's tough what up wolf how you doing man recently got into some chillas are hard to find around here um i don't know bro they maybe hurt me maybe hurt my feelings if it worked for you it worked for you I, I love that for you You launch rallies and join rallies. <laughs> you know, Tajin in there too. And the ramen? Uh, probably not. The ramen's uh, already so salty because it's to the chicken ramen. Because the chicken ramen, unlike the others, has like bullion in there. I live off chicken ramen. I try not to eat that too much anymore. Um, I try to just uh, stick to the rice and broccoli and chicken. It just digests a lot easier. Any advice on chains? I want to get one, but I don't know which one. Um... Personally, my favorite type of chain is like Byzantine links. Um, but I mean like, what type of chain is this? This is like, you really can't go wrong with this type of chain. I don't know what the fuck this is called. This is like the, this is like the classic though. Does anybody know what the, the name of the links on that are? Because the Byzantine links are definitely not beginner friendly. Go to a ramen restaurant, even better. Yeah, I'm not, I, I'm not rich. Okay, I'm making my own. It's gonna suck. What up, Fate? How you doing, man? Welcome. What's up, Figaro? All right, well, there you go. Figaro chain. Figaro, one or the other. These Latinas have started to migrate to Ireland in their numbers, and I'm loving it. Hey, Godspeed, bro. Chicken curry or chicken teriyaki? Um, definitely chicken teriyaki. I mean, don't, I fuck with curry heavy, but like... Bro, I could literally, I could eat teriyaki until my, my brain melts and leaks out of my ear. I could die eating teriyaki. You know what I mean? I probably can't die eating curry. I, I probably could, actually. But Put an egg on ramen we eat in rich out here. Actually, that's what I was going to eat for lunch today. I was thinking about it. I think I'm going to do um, chicken, ramen, and then uh, eggs. Or maybe I'll just eat six eggs for lunch. Ah, I'm an animal! I'm a, I'm a dog. I didn't want to say that out loud. Well, now you, now you guys know. Byzantine chains are awesome, especially the handmade ones. Yeah, they're pretty heat. My Byzantine link, I got mine when I was... Let me see if I still have it. I mean, obviously, I still have it. It's around here. Uh, it's over here, actually. Oh. This is my my old byzantine chain i got this i think i was like 16 when i got this so the bitch everywhere teriyaki is overrated curry is way better uh are you indian having us some fried chicken and ramen well we'll we'll see see how i make this work my breakfast before school is rice with some six eggs all right well heat all right well then then we're <laughs> then we're hitting it you sound like the type of person to eat raw eggs. No, I have a friend that does that though. I have a friend that not only eats raw eggs, he used to eat um, raw beef too. 
Sometimes you get lazy to cook it, you just rip it out the package and eat it. And I was like, dude, you're fucking, you're actually an animal. Are you Indian? Well, my, cause like, usually when I hear, um, cause like, I, I man, I don't want to offend the fuck out of everybody, but like, like I eat, I eat quite a lot of Indian food. I eat way less Asian food and I love Indian food. Okay. Like I go to that, I go to that shit all the time. Or I, at least I used to, it's like, it was, bro, it was like 10 to $15 a person. That place was so fire, bro. <sighs> okay. Uh, beside the point, um, teriyaki is like better. Unless you're Indian, unless you have like a personal like biased take on the situation, unless you look at it and you're like, you know, that you're like, that's my food and that's why it's better. What would your account look like if chain doesn't exist? I don't know. Probably wouldn't be playing. I might get more tan than you. Ooh, why are we so offended, Philip? Sorry, buddy. Okay, stick to your curry. My bad. I'll, uh, I'll, I'll remember to, to phone you in the next time I have a food take. Someone likes curry, they gotta be Indian. No, no, no. It's not if somebody likes curry, they have to be Indian. It's the way he defended. The fervent defense is different. Oh shit, increasing your power. Indian food is heat, right? Indian food is heat. Um, I'm just saying, like, if it's if it's it's head to head, curry versus teriyaki, I'm teriyaki, like all day. Furious is the most goaded intro out of all the iconic creators. Furious intros are wild. They're so out of pocket all the time. I I do fuck with that man, have you? Curry is grim. Uh, I mean, it's not bad. No, 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 no. We are not doing that, Mr. Azra. My mom's food makes me cry and I got a good spice tolerance. Oh, no, my family all sucks with spicy food. Philip is never beating the Indian allegations. Jesus Christ. Guys, we're not doing it, okay? I asked a genuine question. I swear to fucking Christ. It was it was that was a real question. Use a defense token, you noob? Fine, bro. Use a defense token. God damn. I'll kill the fun the fun police out here. Also, you called me a noob and you asked you asked what the fort event was, bro. The fort event was like, they're like, guys, <laughs> he said he said you have to join forts and start forts. <laughs> uh. Free Asder, true. Free Asder. My boy ain't do nothing wrong. Oh shit, hold up. Maybe this is gonna do better than the Richard. I don't get the love of spicy foods. Um, it's an acquired taste, I think. It's just like. I wouldn't say the the spicy food makes it taste better. I would say it would ma it makes it more interesting. Um, kind of like cinnamon, you know, cinnamon has its own taste, but like that, the spice on it is just like, it makes makes eating food more fun, I guess. What's your favorite subject? Like in school? Like what do you mean? I like to talk about Nils. What up? I remember you explaining what to do for Hunt for Histories and FTP. Where can I find it? What up, Nils? Welcome. Glad to have you here. Um, you you just get like you get hammers up to like eighty or hundred, and then you turn them in every so often. Not even sorry for that one. Oh, man. You know, watch yourself, buddy. Okay, I'm not trying to ban you. I fucking will. That shit is wild. You can't say that. Spice for the sake of being spicy sucks. Got of course it has to enhance it. Yeah. Time to buy some cinnamon stock so I can chew on it when I'm bored to have fun. People do that a lot, actually, Gren. That's you say that as a joke. That's that is something that people do. Just having cinnamon stocks around to just fuck around and eat. Yes.
All right, do we have anything else left to do for today? Nope. Yay, we have Scipio too. Cool. It's not wild if it's true. Subject in school. Uh, my favorite subject was probably like philosophy or history or writing, something like that. Any any liberal art really really interested me. Everyone is trying to get that band today. For who? Vaping is where it's at based. He's based. All right, we got five minutes, boys. Let's go. <laughs> Damn liberals. True. College philosophers? Yeah, I, I'm, I, I like philosophy. Philosophy, history, you know, that stuff is it's nice. By the way, if y'all are coming to the stream, please hit that like button, y'all. I'd appreciate that a lot. You're definitely an NP. Let's see. Debater, personality trait with the extroverted, intuitive thing and uh, prospecting traits? Um, I don't know. I took the test. It said I was an NJ, but... I, I truly have no idea. The, your FTP now turned 12? Yo! Hey, I clocked so hard, he clocked the fuck out of me. I saw it and I was like, who's FTP now? I was like, what do you mean by that? FTP now? I was like, excuse me, sir, how much money have you spent? Yo, he's not wrong. Okay? It immediately, my spidey senses were triggered, bro. As soon as I saw, like, your, I'm FTP now, I was like, I was like, what do you mean by that? What do you mean you're F2P? Are you an atheist? I am. Vaping tastes better because... Okay. Okay! Oh, nice. It doesn't even show up. Okay, cool. Just saying, if that had showed up in the main chat, Philip, that would have been a ban. I didn't care how 12 got more power than me because I'm a, I'm a certified farmer, okay? My my time in, in JG was like the, the hyperbolic time chamber, okay? I came, I came out a, a beast. I went in a mortal. I, I came out a god. I was, I was in the pen lifting, okay? I was getting swole as fuck in JG. Y'all have no idea. Hey, what up, Lucas? Welcome. NPs have doubt about the existence of a god? Um, maybe. I mean, I don't know. I don't know if it's it's quite so... I mean, like, I used to be very, very religious, so... Did my, did my personality type change, you know? Did you play the old school God of Wars? No. Burn is mighty if I use spaghetti. <laughs> Best way to get AP, um, it's just don't spend AP out like where you shouldn't. I, I really wish there was more to it, but I mean, really, it's just you know don't don't waste it randomly. Just be an alliance that does enough forts, and then do forts in your off season. You should be fine. Nice. Not the chillest mother fricker. That's crazy. Yeah, it's not my good Christian church or chat. <laughs> we believe you. <laughs> we believe you, bro. It's crazy. I mean, Savin. We have we have our we have our marches here. Okay, we are ready. We have the fleet. Okay, y'all wouldn't understand. Me and Del Gucci in the cut. What the fuck is he doing here? Retreat! You hooligan? Oh, 
Bum, bum, bum. Mm, mm, mm. Let's go, gamers. Why your kid you want to play Tides of War? Is it actually good? I have no idea, bro. I I truly I don't I don't know anything i don't know shit about shit i sit in this kingdom i flail my arms around i cry uh, and that's about it that's that's my <laughs> i i have nothing to do with leadership bro i i fight where they tell me to fight and i call it a day burn definitely calls himself a sigma tides is pretty good yeah i've heard some good stuff about tides Actually, I mean, I could probably join at this. This is uh, it's like a little over 100. What's the uh, what's the the quantity on this? 126. I'm sure nobody's gonna get fucked. Little far away, but yeah, let's make the journey. Let us travel. Huh, can I not go through this? This is a full block? No, this this should be an entrance, right? Am I crazy? Why would I want to go around the other way? Yeah. How can you see account age? Um, you can have somebody click on their VIP or something. Unban myself. I took a 1 mil siege rally from his 170 mil whale and he has full leadership gear. I took 211 sev wounds and only killed 100k siege. That's good, I think. Do you think you push a 100 mil power right now if you needed to? No, I couldn't. What up, TPO? Welcome. Glad to have you here. Are we not popping the directives? You can do both of these? What the fuck is this? Let's go! Let us go, gamers. It's time. It's time for some gaming. You can't push 10 mil? Uh, no, I don't think so. Uh, Diana, what up? To be a garrison leader, do I need to put my home up for sale? Basically, yeah. I'm gonna push an old man? Push two. Read that again. Read it backwards. Yep, Toony Tunes is also right. Are you pushing Zenith tomorrow? Nope. I get, uh, mill power. That's it. Un million, tal vez. Saki murió Toriyama, el creador de Dragon Ball. Sí, a mí me gustaba ese enemy, pero no era como... No era mi favorito ni nada así, así que... Está bien. No, no, está bien, así que es peor que se murió, pero... Eso no me molesta mucho. How long have I been playing? I've been playing for about 850 days. That's why I live in these streets, gang. True! 
Is the new Xena skin any good? Um, yeah, it looks decent. Looks like a good fielding skin. Actually, hold up. Do I want to join this or would I rather join something sooner? Okay. Wait. How am I supposed to know how many I've killed? Am I tripping? Stay on the tide? Oh, got it. Oh shit, all these marshes are gonna die, bro. I thought these marshes were gonna be healthier. Uh, do I have to teleport? Dragonite trying to say top left desperately. I love that for him. Six minutes is a lot. So let's see. Three minutes is not bad. Check your buffs, you need 25 for it. Yep. Yipper, yipper. Oh, nice. That dude's rally's gonna keep me healthy. Is rally gonna die? No, we should kill it. Barely, though. Jesus Christ. Barely. <laughs> right? We we do kill this. We have to. Do we also sell accounts? Uh, I'm a sponsored creator, so no comment. Holy shit. Do we kill? Come on. Oh, we killed it. Holy shit. By the grace of God. Oh my Jesus Christ. Wow, that was a uh that was an adventure. Okay. Uh let's level this up and then we're gonna go for bar reports. <clears throat> Zoras, what up man? How you doing? Hey, what up, man? Welcome. Glad to have you here. Uh, what power should a 9 days FTP play, uh, player be? I don't know, like a little over 1.5, probably like 1.7, 2 mil. Man, rip Guan Yu. Guan Yu was the tallest tree, he said.
Do you think ZL would have smooched uh, Guan Yu if given the opportunity? Devising battle plans is crazy. Yes, you, you definitely have the permission, yes. Let's go! Woo! Let's go, real, real gamer, ZL. Hey, what's up, foe? Welcome to the stream. Glad to have you here. What is today's plan? Today's plan is we do our, our alliance directive and then we chain. Playing on the PC official rock app for main, blue stacks for one farm, phone for the second. Nice, make it work. The empty four strategy base. And ZL is throwing a hissy fit right now. All right, let's see. All right, more forts, boys. More forts. All right, so tides, alliance directives. He said to the left, I'd be able to look at it. Um, tap on a lens directive. Where, so where does it say that? Oh, oh, does it say in like the, the top left of my screen? Is it like an overall thing? Ah, there we go. So double time, March P.8. Okay, cool. Blue stacks run like shit, bad optimization. True, but it's got multi, uh, multi instancing. So mentally handy putting farms on my phone and switching one by one. Yeah, that's what I did. So. Hey. How many times should I open my farming accounts per day? I have four. Um, I don't know, as many times as you can. That is what I do. I just open them as many times as I can, call it a day. I'm going to start again. Not a bad idea. Where can I find jumper groups? Um, you can go to the jumper ads part on my Discord, or you could go to the uh, the official um, jumper community Discord, which we're uh, partnered with. Okay. Oh. Nice, check on hinges messaging me. a multi-instance sandbox but it broke for me ages i couldn't be asked to fix it yeah i would rather i'd rather just run the the blue stacks call today i'm not I, i'm not you know i'm not intelligent enough Whew. why do you think all the women in your life leave you after a few months because i'm a sociopath 
because I do all the things that a regular person should do um, in terms of like showing affection and stuff. And they're, they're the my motivations for doing so are broken. And so when somebody sees something like that, they assume one thing and then curiosity uh, kills them. So they have to ask and they ask and then, you know, they're disappointed with the answer they get. LD player is so easy to use and never give me problems. Also less laggy than blue stacks. Um, I multi instance with LD before, but blue stacks generally, I think once you get to like past like 10 to 12 instances, blue stacks generally gave me the best support. I've, um, I've done, I've done four with Nox and I think I've done four with LD as well, but blue stacks, once I, once I got past four, uh, blue stacks was the most stable for me. At least you're honest. Well, I mean, I, I, I like, it's not like I want to be like this, you know? You know, but whether I was I was born like this or whether I was made into this by my life experiences, yeah, I was just it, it is it's just a fact of my life. Hey, Jackie, thank you so much for the five USD super chat, man. I appreciate it. Hey, Broski, just responded to your Discord ticket. Oh, cool. All right, yeah. As soon as this event ends, then we can uh, we can run the coaching. Hey, I appreciate the uh, I appreciate the donation. If you guys didn't know, we are sponsored by Rise of Kingdoms, but every single donation helps a ton. Thank you, thank you. In other words, they can't handle the truth. Uh, that's true. They can't handle the truth. But I, I think it's reasonable to not be able to handle the truth, to be fair, though. I don't think many people are built like that. You're raised right, bro. Fuck them. I, was, I did not have a great childhood. Or a, young, uh, a good young adult life. My formative years were quite uh, weird. Um... No, there's, like, definitely, like, it's not, yeah. Do you think you'll still talk to Kim in two months? Um, I don't know. Hey, Isaac, thank you so much for the gifted membership, man. I appreciate it. Bioshock, hey, enjoy your honors TP title and welcome to the chain gang. Shout out to my boys. Hey, thank you so much for your donations, guys. I really appreciate it. Uh, I really appreciate it a lot. It really helps a ton. Um, thank you so much. Kim, multi instance with eight on LD player plus rock PC. I can't. Oh, well, shit. Who knows? Can I can multi instance rock on blue stacks with the same email? Uh, no, it has to be different. But multi instance anyway, you don't have to like relog or anything. Yeah, shout out to my boy. When's the next account roasting? Uh, I'm not sure. Whenever I feel like it really. What do you mean, drug dealing is a normal part of childhood? Yeah. Blue stacks or LD player? Um, it's whatever one works better for you. Different emulators work better for different people, so I would try them both out and see which one it works better for you. Are you afraid of your last guest making more friends and then not talking to you anymore? Oh, um, no. I mean, it's not impossible that, that happens, but that's not something that's not something that would concern me. I mean, I'd rather she keep talking to me, but um, I don't know. People in life come and go, you know, <clears throat> like as you, I don't know, as you traverse through life, I mean, there's like, there's, I've known literally thousands of people, and I talk to one person currently. So, I mean, I, I don't know. It's it's like the circle of life. You can't always, like, maintain meaningful relationships forever. Deuces, Dragonite. Take it easy, man. When are we going to see the second channel? Fucking never, bro. What the hell? Y'all are crazy. Finally, 250 mil power. Nice. Mm -mm. Nice, uh, working on that double time, boys. Delicious mark speed. Feel free to roast my account on top of the coaching. Thank you so much for the donation, man. I, I really appreciate it. I I, I try to be as uh, cordial and reasonable as I can when I uh, when I do my coaching. So you know, I'd say no worries, man. I don't know if you're looking for roasting, but. Um, I mean, I can rate your account. I remember the, the last guy that got private coaching for me, basically off the private coaching. Cause he wanted like a couple commander pairings and he wanted me to roast his account. He's like, give me a rating right now. He's like, that's what I came here for. And I was like, I gave him the rating. Uh, we did a couple pairings and he did. And I was at, it was like a 10 minute, 15 minute session. So, um, but no, nah, I, yeah, I'm, I'm a, I'm a respectful young man out here, but thank you so much for the five USD Jackie. I really do appreciate it again. Y'all, Hey, y'all's donations are what keep us full time. Okay. Uh, as much as I, I love my boys a lot, um, you know, we, we cannot we cannot live off that. It's y'all. So thank you so much. Are you still active on it? Yep. You say you leak it when it goes big enough as a social experiment? 
Yeah, in, in like... Oh, shit. Uh, where, where is it? Did I miss it? Hey, Will D donating 15 bucks. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Just thanks. Thank you. I appreciate it, man. Thank you. Thank you. That was my buddy, uh, 33 and 21. Please be savage. Jackie's getting coached this stream. Jackie from 3321. Are you, are you a celebrity? Jesus Christ. All right. Well, we'll see. I'll, I'll try to be, uh, or, hey, we're reasonable. We're reasonable out here. But yeah, thank you so much for the donations, man. I appreciate it. Shout out to Will. Thank you as well. Um, your guys' donations, it really means a lot. Thank you. If you guys want to help support the channel, the best way you can do so is by donating to the Streamlabs link in the description below. Every donation helps an absolute shitload. Thank you, boys. Jackie, you have to drop a buff heavy hitter account with no mistakes. I've seen some pretty good whale accounts, so okay. Getting getting the uh getting the hopes up. Dropping dubs like a boss. I bet he's got the low-key dub count. We'll see. We'll see. He's king from 3321 and imp kvk2kd. Okay, cool. That's what's up. Do you want both forts and chaining? Well, I'd be chaining the five marches if I had to. The forts are le less uh, less intensive than the chaining. I did actually, now that I, um, I coached another, uh, another Jackie, um, that was also a whale and a king at one point, but, uh, he, that was a long time ago, though. He only did private coaching, though. As do, as do most, uh, whales. Most of, like, the mega, like, 8k, like, 10k, uh, a month people are, are like, are definitely, uh, mo more covert. I don't think he plays anymore, though. Did you finish this MK event? I finished it on the second day, I think. Uh, I feel like an old man seeing the newest iPhone. Dude, I feel like that all the time. Like, when I see, like, kingdoms beefing with each other and shit, I'm like, I'm like, damn, like... Wait, like, when I think of a kingdom over the 3000s, I'm like, I'm like, did those really exist? Yeah, I think 3358 lost their, their KL though, which is so sad. Send you a Corden game. What are we looking at? I'm not, I, I, whatever this is followed with, so to my OF, we're not, we're not, we're not peeping this. Wild. Uh, Joe Polos? Yes, sir. Let me in, Mr. Polo. Reached? Yeah, that's actually like too far away. Okay, five minutes, we can do that. NBD, some might say. Do, 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 do. Trust. I never look at chords. Uh, all right, all right, Mr. Hammy, we'll see. Oh, that's too far away. If it was closer. If it was closer, I'd fuck with the vision, but too far. When's the last time you went to an all you can eat? Um I just go all the time with my ex. I don't know, actually. It, it may have been a long time, actually. 
Because that, that was specifically something I used to do with my ex that I don't do anymore. Not that I don't like those places. I mean, they're close to me still, but yeah. It's been a while. It may, it, maybe I went to a spot with my mom, perhaps, like six months ago. But in the last, like, over a year, it's been, like, once, maybe twice. He goes on a two-day fasting streak before hitting the all-you-can-eat. No, your stomach is too small if you do that. Usually, I'll just, I'll fast out, like, the, the, uh... The morning. 33 for the 8. Def did not lose their KL. Oh, they told me. They lost. Ah, they're just fucking with me. What's up, Ace? How you doing? Honor update? We're like 15. Who messaged you with that? That was, uh, uh, Hammy. Ackle Hammy. They're, they're, they're a combo. They're a two-piece. I'm in 58. You know who's gaslighting you? Uh, I think it was Warfish. Path of Greatness. Oh, there's there's quests for destroying forts? I didn't even know that. It's goaded. It's sauced. Alright, let's go. Alright, having a 5% march speed on everybody is going to be kind of nice. <laughs> Yeah, he did. Uh, he did give me the the juicy gaslight. Oh, we're almost halfway, boys. Okay, just a just a few more rallies, and we can be done. We can lay it to rest. Are you joining the gaslight? Why don't you have much resources? Because I hate resources. I hate gathering. I hate killing. I hate playing KVK. So I push for honor next KVK. I have uh, two chaining marches and 750,000 AP stored. Can I get top one? Um, it's not impossible. It just generally has to do with you if you win or lose. If you lose uh, KVK, you're probably not getting top ten. You ever feel that life is not real? No. For better or for worse, your perception is reality. I often do look in the mirror and don't recognize myself, though. I actually wrote a really good poem about that recently. It's actually fire. Yeah, that was a good piece, actually. I'm probably going to show that on the second channel. Like, this is all in your head? It, the thing is, it doesn't matter if it's all in your head or not. Why would it, right? If you can't see it, if you can't feel it, if you can't touch it, if you can't experience it, it may as well not be real. It, it, the thing is, is like, it doesn't matter if it's real or not, right? It's like, if you're in the Matrix right now, if you're plugged into a machine, right, and you're eating a steak, and that steak, you know, you're eating a, a nice, juicy steak, and you, for all intents and purposes, it doesn't matter that you're plugged into a machine. It doesn't, right? You're the only one that can fuck up life for yourself and fuck up your own perception of life. Because frankly, it doesn't matter. Clipping that and send it to your R5 back to judge? I can't even remember what I said. <laughs> I can't remember what I said. I love gathering so easy and gives you so much value. Oh, yeah. Yeah, for sure, Trinity. Hey, Trinity's trying to... He's got me. It's Jover. Two point two 2.2, boys. I love KVK. I hate the weeks of gathering. No, hell yeah. That's the worst part. Do you know 3358? I do. A little bit. A smidge. Oh. Is the marsh speed permanent? Yeah, for the KVK it is, Johnny. Welcome to the stream, man. How you doing? From what I'm told, for the low price of 1500 UTC, you can buy 2605, start the donations for 12 to take over R5 there. No, they're selling the entirety of 2605? That's crazy. They, they didn't give it back to the natives? Yo. Dude, I'd be devastated. If I was one of the natives of 2605, and like I was you know just there like trying to make my kingdom work, they take it, and then they sell it? Dude, I'd have a seizure. I'd, I'd be sobbing, bro. No, they're not selling it, right? 
I need to know, good sire. How bad is 25 mil KP earlier in 58? Uh, is it KVK1? I mean, that's not horrible. I don't know. I mean, like, having, like, I don't know. KP, KVK1, I don't really give a fuck about. Let's go, bar reports. Finally. Finally, bar reports. I'm told it's up for sale. They're not going to turn it over to anyone there. Wow, that's insane. That's crazy. Wait, if they sell it, though, I mean, like, that's that's a kingdom that Shish School is, like, deeply affiliated with. That's that's crazy, actually. That's nuts. I, I'd ask, like, what does he do about it? I mean, I guess he doesn't do anything, right? I mean, those are his homies. Damn, that's nuts. Seems like telling you to do Jace type of joke. You're awful, bro. You're terrible. There's literally nothing left after it's all said and done. 1500 for a losing KD. I mean, like, 1500 for a KD is fine. Also, the fact that you could, like, pick it up and kind of do whatever to it is probably appealing. It's just... Wow. Hmm. Wow, wow, wow. Jesus Christ. Getting sold. Perhaps they bought 2605 in the first place? As far as I understand, they did not buy 2605. Um, it, was, it was taken from the natives. Am I actually getting rewards for this? This is too little damage to give me, to give me shit. No! Oh! No crystals? Ah! That's horrid. Tell us just a selling a KD. I would never do that, bro. That's awful. Um, it's my coworker, bro. It's your fresh, you got time true. You just got posted in the Rock Discord? What do you mean? Oh, where? Oh, you're... Are you just trolling? What up, Morningstar? How you doing? Check official media. Hello, Rise of Kingdoms uploaded a new video. What the fuck are you talking about? Oh, you're you look like the guy next to Joan. I thought it was you. Okay, that's I'm glad we could we have we we could stop our our scheduled session for our, our daily dose of autism. Thank you. <laughs> uh, that's fucking dumb. <laughs> Joan, Joan is 16, boys. Joan is not bad. Ramen, what up, man? Glad to have you. They're saying you look like the angel of the cover, I, I guess. I, I just don't understand. I don't think, like, I, it's not even a good troll. Uh. 
Oh, you're saying I look like an angel? Uh, we have one coaching today. I don't want to do too much because obviously I want to stick to mostly um, chaining, but yeah. Well, to be fair, I'm pretty sure Philip is 15, so. <sighs> Legal in England? Crazy. How am I doing? Um, I've been better, I've been worse, you know, the vibes. Oh man, my poor, my poor, uh, my poor Ethel fled. Get trolled. What up, Owen? How you doing? My KVK one starts tomorrow. Godspeed, soldier. Playing the playing the game is just meant to be played. KVK, none of this home kingdom shit. Okay, as it should be. Oh, dude, barb reports too. Holy shit! Ah, rip. Well, I, I I locked it right. That counts. Um, how difficult is this to get to marching orders three? Come on, just let me get to marching orders three. I'm begging. Give me like if I can get like barb reports four, I'll be very happy with that. Ah, barb report four. What makes you think she's sixteen? She died at nineteen. I have no idea. I mean, I, I thought she was 16. Oh! Okay, never mind. Poggers. Artemisia R34. True. How many resources do you have gathered? Uh, not shit. We have 1.6 bill resources gathered. <clears throat> Can sniff their age? Oh my god. Thanks, MFTP. Awesome, man. Godspeed. Spawn camping is insane. Oh, shit. Next. All right. How close? How far are we in here? All right. 3%, boys. We got, uh, what? 10 more forts to go and we're done. I don't know shit about histories. What did she do that's so well known? She died at 19. Um, basically, <clears throat> at different points in history, sometimes the French were at their highest in their peak, and sometimes sometimes England was at its peak. Um, this was probably one of the darkest times for France ever. England was way better equipped, and they were just shitting on them repeatedly. Um, and France, I don't, I don't even know if France had um, a king at this point, right? France just had the Dauphin. <clears throat> we're pretty sure actually sold out, uh, what's her face, uh, Joan of Arc, uh, in one of the worst betrayals ever. Um, see Barb, eat Barb. Hey, you already know. What up, Uggy? Uh, no, nah, we're eating them raw. You already know. Thank you so much for the donation, man. Welcome to the honor FTP, uh, or welcome to the chain gang. Enjoy your honor FTP title. Welcome back, my man. Thank you, thank you. She what major ass in France? Herself, she didn't whoop ass. She was like a, she was like a, a banner to rally behind. She was like, she was like the symbol of everything France could be, right? She was like, basically the whole thing is like, she was essentially ordained by God to save France. And then was betrayed by the Dauphine, which was horrific. <laughs> it was like one of the worst things to ever happen. Um, and I want to say the Burgundians killed her. And then Burgundy went from like a, just a, a random Fleur, Fleur de Lis have her to... Uh, I want to say Burgundy was a whole ass country for a hot minute there, right? Because they had uh, John the Fearless. And then they had John the Fearless who participated in the Crusades and he came back. And then the guy who, who executed Joan was... Who the fuck was John the Fearless' son? Uh, uh, is Philip a Burgundy? I can't remember. 
<clears throat> she helped crown the Duffian. Yeah, he, he teabagged her. And he definitely learned all of this from Rock. I don't know. I don't know if that's in Rock. That's like some of the most shameful shit in like French history, probably like ever. Uh, is is like the the growing of of Joan and the horrific betrayal by the hands of the Varanians. <clears throat> Necro, what's up, man? How you doing? Uh, I knew you could drop some knowledge. No sweat. <laughs> Twelve loves Joan because he cross dresses a man. True. We're gonna become a country for a wee bit. Yep, it was pretty big too. What place are you in the honor leaderboard? Uh, top 15 right now. Oh, do we have lightning strike the whole time? Haste. Very epic. Very cool. Sorry, the Hundred Years' War started in... Uh, oh, the Hundred Years' War lasted more than 100 years. So, she probably had something to do with that. Uh, yeah, it was 116 years. So, she died in uh, 19, uh, 1431. Uh, the Hundred Years' War lasted until 1453 or something. Yep. 53. Are you playing Arco Osiris? Um, I'm not actually. I'm not. I'm not on our team. Um, I wanted to, uh, but apparently I was not in the team, and I I just used the regular sign up thing because they're they're running a different team for OL. Um, and I was like, fuck. That could have had a team. I just thought I thought I was in the main. Um, very sad. Okay, I've done a shitload of forts. Are we almost done? It feels like we've done more than twenty five forts. Feels like we have gone. We have surpassed our limits. Are we getting canceled? Nope. Uh, Onion, what up, man? How you doing? Uh, time for South Park? Godspeed. What's the highest level in Call to Arms 2 that you've ever gotten? Um, I've come close to max. Have I maxed Call to Arms 2? I'm not entirely. I Honestly, I don't know. I couldn't tell you off the top of my head. I may have maxed it, though. Oh my god, Fearin! Today's episode of Fearin is out. I watched the uh, Unwanted Undead uh, adventure before I started the stream, though, and that was heat. That was fire. Yoshino, what up, man? I am in 1365. Don't you have some top-notch medieval head? Holy Jesus Christ. All right, let's see. So 3.6, so we have seven forts left. We have three in progress, so it's gonna be four after this. Okay. We're almost done. Speaking of which, it is Bastion time. Sadly, we didn't have any, we didn't have any fort killing Bastions. I think that would've been pretty good. Have you looked at the Panzer Dragon allegations? Um, as far as I know, the allegations are just him being cringe, but I did hear about them. I didn't look too deep into them. I don't know. It's like, bro, Panzer Dragons is like one of the guy who kind of like motivated me to be a League of Legends streamer. Like I'm a cutie pie, Panzer Dragons, like those are like real like OG streamers. Um, and so it's very fucking depressing to me, the idea that something like that could come out just because they're I'm mean, like, they're, they're my inspiration, right? Like, they're the whole reason. Because the thing is, is like, Panzer Dragon, I want to say he was challenger at one point for a very small amount of time. But, like, frankly, like, Panzer, Panzer's never been, like, a great player, right? He's never been a, a great player. I mean, he's kind of funny in, a, like, an autistic kind of way. And I looked at that and I said, damn, if that, I can do it, I was like, all I have to do is, is keep my head on the, on the millstone and I can do this shit. For Archer, 222 is better than DB. Kind of, bro. I don't know. 
Uh, so right now, there's a couple different builds going around for archers. So every single archer build is using uh, weapon and helm. So weapon and helm are always happening for KVK shit, right? So one build is uh, Milky Way, uh, Leadership Pants, Boots, and Gloves. Another build is Dragon's Breath uh, Chest and Dragon's Breath Boots, Leadership Pants, Leadership Gloves. Another build is uh, Dragon's Breath Chest and Gloves, uh, Leadership Pants and Boots, and yeah, those are the those are the builds out there. What? When the YKP resource dead power solo, I'm just going to start yapping. Uh, I don't know. Like, I, I just, that shit triggers the hell out of me. <laughs> How dope would it be if we get a Sun Tzu Prime in our next imp release? We need that ASAP. Uh, not impossible. Um, I'm a cutie pie. It looks like he'd be like that, but he isn't as far as I know. Yeah, I mean, like, I don't know, man. It's also weird that the League of Legends streamers, like, never got in shape, bro. They just, like, were just fat and degenerate forever. Hey, what's up, Reaper? Hi, I'm Mew. Oh. Never break the streak. Oh shit, if you don't know that meme, then that looks crazy to you. But if you did, it was cool. It was funny. Oh yeah, the Smash community? Hey, Trinity's actually completely right, bro. The Smash community, it's like, I, it'd be more surprised they weren't. I, I Honestly, I would never, ever. I would just go by the expectations they already are. Dante's is ripped, though? True, but that's that's the new gen, right? <clears throat> Dante's came, came like 12 years after the, the old guard, the OGs. If I send you some crazy stuff to account review, let me know if I didn't send enough info. Um, sure, I would not. I I don't know. I mean, like, you're not supposed to send stuff. I, like, I'll make an announcement when it's time to send stuff in. Do you mute? Hell no. <laughs> no, I already have, like, fucked up teeth and stuff. Like, I, I'm not trying to, uh, I'm not trying to put any more pressure on, on my jaw. Oh, what the hell? All right, slick. All right, we got five left, boys. Only elite player who I see are ripped were ripped before they started playing. Yeah. Kush, what up, man? How you doing? Finally good to catch you live. Found you a Discord. I'm in. Well, glad to have you here, man. The new gen of league streamers are a lot of gym bros. True. Gotta, I gotta, gotta play some more. Back in the days, Tyler, one who was ripped in the rest were either skinnier or out of shape, yeah. Where'd you send the announcement in Discord? I'm going for a negative score. I don't know. T1 is just walking muscle, can't forget about him. Yeah, but he was like a he was like a D1 athlete, right? Before he <laughs> before he came what he is today. Um I don't know if we could we'd ever really like compare that. Uh where'd you send the announcement? Oh, I, I haven't sent the announcement yet. I'm wondering if Scipio Prime and the new Smite Inf is good at 511 each, very low in gold heads. Yeah, that's fine. Um, but I, I'd like to expertise the LC. I find KVK with 12 and power. Is that good? No. Your highest rank in league? I was masters. As long as you don't mouth breathe, you don't need to mew. Not like you should really mew anyway. Um, I mean, I don't know. Mewing does some shit for you. It just depends on how, like, hoed you are. You know what I mean? Like, if you're fat, like, mewing's not gonna help you. If your chin is, like, deformed, mewing's not gonna help you. Right? Mewing is probably for people who have, like, an okay jawline and want it to be slightly better. Um... Like if your if your shit is like horrifically like weak chin, like you're gonna need to get surgery, bro. Two one is a freak of nature, true. It's Freedom Eagle, ah. The boys are meeting up. We love to see it. Yeah, this shit took a long fucking time. It's only twenty five forts, right? Took me a whole ass hour. Mewing is good for you. you. Should do jaw exercises as well. It's hard. It's hard to um because it just puts a lot of wear on your jaw. From what I understand, anyway. Not that I've ever mewed. Thank God. Look, I, I've been fucked by genetics in a in a lot of different ways. My jawline was not one of them. I lost weight. My jawline came out. I was very happy with it. Thank God. 
I have, I have other ba other battles, um, just not one of them. Height? Mm, I mean, I'm what five nine? Five nine is fine, bro. Height only starts to become an issue if you're like if you're like five three or under. Okay, height's an issue. All right, if you're five three or under. I got you, big dog. But I mean, like when I was five six, bro, I was chilling. I was I was making it work. Hey, Dad, what's up? Nothing much? Streaming? Well. Yeah, well that's that's not me. I, I honestly could not tell you. I... Sure. Let me do that. Bye. Yo, yo, could you, yo? <laughs> My dad calls me. My dad calls me. In his first sentence, he goes, "What is up with your generation?" He's like, "All they care about is alpha males and cucks." I'm like, "Dad." I'm like, "Dad, yo." I'm like, "I'm live, bro." Uh, a lot of the looks maxing things aren't issues when you're doing athletic things. Like when you run, you're already supposed to use your nose to breathe. True. Well, I, I use my nose and mouth to breathe when I run. It's, um, you breathe uh, through in, 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 in through your nose and mouth and out through your nose and mouth at the same time to get more oxygen. I'm also asthmatic, so it's important for me. Um, <laughs> uh, there's a lot of fat people who lay in bed. That is true. Uh, a lot of people like old 12 sit at home watching anime and playing rock. Okay. The reason why... It was not that I was sitting at home and, and watching anime and playing rock. I could not, uh, like, my dog was crippled. It's like, if I was spending time and playing with my dog, like, I was, I couldn't, I, we couldn't leave him alone. He was like, he was like, a, like an autistic child. You know what I mean? Like, it was like, um, like that level of like around the clock care. Because I, I'll remind you, okay? The second, the second, like, he didn't get full attention, the way he died, he tripped, fell, and immediately had a heart attack. Like, that was it. That was, that was the whole, that was the end for Spike. That man was ancient. What the fuck is this? Why are we, why? What the hell is happening? Furious. Don't blame him for your fatness. Bro, he died and I immediately started losing weight. Sounds like a hamster type of death. Well, he's 15, so. All right, we got what? Two more forts left? Go in the birthday girl's fort. Boom. All right, so this is the last one for him. You're walking for the last one, and then he's doing the last one. All right, we're done. Ah, <sighs> fort's done, bro. Natural selection right there. Please, let's not shit talk my dead dog. Okay, guys? I got it. We're all memers here. Perhaps we could have just the smallest amount of class. We could potentially rise up. Okay, y'all? I know. I know it's a lot to ask current day, especially in this chat for human decency. Let's not shit talk my dead dog. Could we? Is that possible? Rip dog had to put mine down two months ago. My dog died November 22. Ah, still have his, still have his, his framed photo in my living room. Shout out to Spike. That dude made my life so fucking hard. It was actually insane. He just wanted to spend his entire last days with you. And that he did. Okay. I was fat and I was poor. And it was specifically because of Spike. Don't mean I didn't love him. Okay. I did. And I spent hella time with him, as why I was fat and poor.
Mm -mm 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 -mm. Was your dog American? Yes, he was a uh, he was an American pit bull terrier. Wait, no, I think he, he's just pit bull terrier. I don't is American pit bull terrier is that a breed? Yes, he's an American dog. That's an American breed. I don't know why the fuck I said American pit bull terrier. Got our ashes in a paw stamp. So when I uh, when my dog uh, passed, it was actually a Sunday. So the um. The cremation services and the euthanasia services were both gone. Because everything, like, Texas is one of those places where it's very religious, so uh, everything is closed on Sundays. Um, so when he died, we could not get him euthanized, so I watched him die, and then we couldn't get him cremated, so I had to physically bury him myself. Um, that was a rough day. Dog died, your wife left you, and you were fat. Sad times. That is true. What up, Jackie? How you doing? Whales jumping AP? Cat left after Spike passed. How are you chaining like eight hours a day and still not rank one honor? Because people are five marching. Also, Jackie is right. My cat is 16 years old and still active. How long that will last, I wonder? Cats can last like 25 years, depending on the breed. Pitbulls usually don't last past eight or 11. So that was a miracle that Spike lasts as long as he did. All right, boys. <laughs> on other notes, it is coaching time, okay? We've done everything we have to do, pretty sure. All right, we're short like two. So yeah, double time caps out at five. So let's do this shit. Send him a message. Oh shit, that's not it. No, 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 hey, no! Okay. Be right back, gamers. Is the account that has to be roasted? We're not gonna, we, we don't roast people on the coaching. Um, so rest assured, guys, it's gonna be a nice standard coaching sesh. Oh, my body hurts. I worked out yesterday and it was supposed to be a rest day, but uh, my hair looks good, so fuck it, it is what it is. Man, I have a few loose hairs that are absolutely just molesting my eyeballs, bro. God have mercy. When are you going to let me help you with the farms? Where did 12 go? 12 went to the bathroom. Mr. Chair is better. It's Jover. Alright, boom, guys. The payment is in. It is, uh... Let's see be coaching time let us make sure this last one works okay we're, we're overseeing the last bar report and then we will be doing coaching if you guys are interested in getting your own coaching sessions you guys can go to the discord in the description below and you guys can make a ticket um it is 35 bucks for an on-stream session and 75 bucks for an off-stream session are your coaching clients pretty much spenders only yeah i would say i probably had like four or five ftps ever the thing is is like usually you're f2p because you have to be f2p you're not f2p because you want to be f2p so Team Snapchat sent you a message. Thanks, Snapchat. No, no, no! Jesus Christ. I'm gonna copyright my stuff. Snapchat? Ew. Alright.
All right, cool. How have you been? Also, you good... You know a good server that my friends can go to that's active and friendly and talkative? You should go to mine. My Discord's in the description below. Okay. It is coaching time, boys. I do not read chat while I am coaching. So, uh, you know, if you guys got questions for the sesh, you know, remember to ask it afterwards. No sense of camaraderie. Jesus Christ. All right. Let's give him a call. Hey, bro. Hey, man. How you doing? I'm doing good, dude. All right. Can you say testing, you? testing? Yeah. Okay. That should be good. Um, no, no, that works. Yep. All right. Yeah, I'm doing good. It's a, it's a good day. I'm not... I was not planning on doing coaching today, but um, I had the other line spent going on. I was like, oh, fuck it. I can do a session. Um, so. Yeah, I appreciate it, man. Yeah, of course, of course. Uh, do you know how to screen share? Yeah, let me turn that on. And let me know, let me know if you can see it. I can see it, so I'm gonna throw you up on the other screen and let us go. Okay. Uh, there we go. All right, cool. Um, so what are we looking to get out of the session? How can I help? Uh, just different ways I can improve. I'm going into KVK two and uh, trying to see what my best commander pairings you would recommend doing and how I can, you know, get the most out of my account. Okay, cool. Um, what's your monthly budget? Um, I don't know. A uh, couple, couple thousand. Okay, so you're um, mo mainly I ask because usually I'll I'll do some kind of budgeting for people, but if they're buying, so for example, if you're buying like every, um, if you're doing every egg event, every Dalrook's puzzle box, every Esmeralda's house, and every wheel, then there's less need for me to to uh, uh, write uh, down everything. Are you doing all of that or? Um, yeah okay. pretty much um i i used to do just about every single one but then i was told i needed to well not needed to but i shouldn't do esmeralda's house and dalrock's box so i just kind of like get my 10 and then i go and then i max out the um dig and the egg event but if you know Mm, let's People give me different advice yeah let's let's just go so spending per month so we'd look to like a monthly budget look like something like two thousand or do you, like what, what are you comfortable spending usually um two thousand is a good start yeah okay cool. uh, i could go up a little more okay um oh your stream went down oh did it mm -hmm. here let me see Yeah, that's weird. I'm sorry. No, you're fine. And there we go. Okay. So, let's see. So we got... So you get the plus sign on the gems at the top, right? Yep. And then go to the supply depot. I'm going to start writing down this stuff, so... Sorry, say again. What was that last part? Go to the supply depot. Supply depot. Gotcha. Okay, so we got Lucerne. We got gem supply. 10 we got the resource supply i don't know if i keep doing that but okay just because you're already you're already maxed right or do you have your academy finished or do you have um uh do you have you not yeah. done siege okay it's finished uh one of my friends just told me to stock up on it for uh soc not a bad idea i guess if it's a newer account i i, I yeah. can see better safe than sorry i suppose for 15 bucks it's not too bad um Okay, so then we're gonna have dailies. 
We're doing pop-ups. Um, okay, then let's go to the super value bundle and scroll over to the right. Okay. I'd make sure you're doing at least the first two purchases of New World every month. The cheapest you can get a passport is five bucks a passport. Um, and you know, right now you may not plan to move, but your account is always going to be ginormous. So. Um, okay. There you go. Purchases of New World. Um, yeah, the cheapest you can get a passport is five bucks a passport, and so yeah, you always want to do those probably every month. Um, okay. Let's see what else we have here. Dailies, pop-ups. Okay, and then so you're doing call the ancients uh, twice a month. Yep. Okay, that will be seven eight five. Okay, and then you're going to be running. Actually, that won't be seven seventy. Okay. Um, and then you're going to be doing a dig event when you see it. You buy out the full bundle for that. Yeah. Solid. Uh, we like that. So then we're buying holiday bundles. Um, it's probably going to run you like one fifty every three months, something like that. And then we're going to say limited time bundles. Probably looking something like. 250 a month, so like Flames of War and really anything that pops up that looks unique, you end up picking up yeah. generally? Cool. Um, okay, dig, holiday bundles, limited times. Um, and then how old is your account? Are we in Season of Conquest yet? Or, oh no, you're going KVK2, you said. Okay. Yeah, here, uh, let me see. 468 days. Okay. Um, so limited time, holiday bundles. And so when you're buying super value bundles, do you ever just buy, are you buying like geared up or perhaps like, the Arma Maniac or something like that? Uh, I don't have the Arma Maniac, but I did buy Geared Up a lot. I just kind of throttled back on it because, I don't know, uh, other bundles popped up and I just, I've been told that it's not, it's great for initial, like, um, start of the game, but it's not the best value that you can get. And that, like, the dig, the, um, and the egg ones are way better, and I should just wait for those. The Holy Knight's Treasure bundle? Yeah, Holy Knight's Treasure. Oh, that, that bundle's the, literally the exact same as Geared Up. That's actually something I was going to tell you. I was like, if you stop buying Geared Up, you, you should not buy the, uh, the Holy Knight's Treasure. It's like, if you, if you look at them side by side, they're the exact same thing. Um, okay. I would say... Yeah, I was just... Hmm. Oh, go ahead. Uh, I was going to say the armament pickups are, are fine. Yeah, I, I'd be swapping. I will hear you in a, in a bit, but... Um, okay. Armament bundles you know if you buy like a couple of months I, I wouldn't be too concerned with that like maybe um per month is good they like yeah um then swap to the two week arm bundle uh um for 770 and so i take it you're doing rally garrison for your kingdom I I did, but uh, with the new migrants coming in, probably not. I'll be probably open fielding. Okay, cool. Um, yeah. So the when your armor maniac stuff comes in, which is going to be like a, it's like an armament bundle that comes with the same consistency as probably like Holy Ancients. Um, I'd be buying that for a bit, probably until you can get like twenty five, thirty percent stats on your marches. Um, and then yeah. if you're comfortable with that, you can keep buying if you want to, depending on what what amount your uh. What amount you're comfortable spending at, especially with the the way transmutation stones work now, uh, compared to you know it was a, it was a little harder <laughs> when when Armaments <laughs> first came out. Um, but now the, those bundles will take you um, a little further. So if you can get like I would say um, like twenty five to thirty percent stats, then you can start to consider spending elsewhere. Or eventually, if you start tapering off your spender uh, spending, that's where I would start tapering it. Um, I got it. okay. Then we're gonna say so gems per month. So I mean you're 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 getting like. You're getting like 600,000 gems per month, probably something like that. Something ridiculous, I think. Yeah? <laughs> yeah, something like that. Okay, so you're VIP 18, right? Yeah. Okay, so more than gems into probably like VIP uh, materials. Um, and plus like, uh, so if you go to your VIP shop, what do you uh, normally buy yeah. before the gems? Uh, honestly, whatever I can, usually I get a little impulsive. And I buy everything else out before more than gems come out. But I've been saving. I haven't been buying the gold heads as much because people say it's um, not as value uh, as other things I can buy. True. Well, how many sculptures do you have? Uh, I should. Let me check. Nope. Sorry, wrong button. 
Uh, ten thirteen. Soldier's probably not a bad pickup for you, I would say. Uh, just because, like, your, um, at your spending level, so the scarcity is less with, like, how much value can you get from your gems, whereas, like, where can you spend your gems, period. Just because um, you basically, if you can avoid a situation where you're, like, dropping raw gems into, like, troop training, you're, like, that. ideally you never do that, right? You can spend your gems in a way that they'll always benefit you. Um, and so, like, I'm not... Um, I'm not a huge fan of the sculptures forever, but as you start building up into Season of Conquest, right, you're going to have, like, m at least three sets of gear, um, and those three sets of gear are going to need, um, you know, like, 4,200 sculptures in order to, to, you know, put on properly. Um, and so, yeah. I mean, buying them early is not too bad. So I, I think the... Um, uh, so weekly sculpts yeah. is going to run you 40k, and, and we're just going to run... We're going to say the... Um, you're just gonna fit more than gems somewhere in here. I think that's fine. Um, so doll rooks is gonna run you. I would do doll rooks puzzle box as well. I think puzzle box is fine. I think egg is fine. Um, in terms of like spending gems, like I would do doll rooks puzzle box, Esmeralda's house. I would do both of those before I buy uh, weekly sculptures. So the weekly sculptures would be the f like one of the last things on this that I would pick up. Um, okay. Not that that's it's fine. yeah, not not that it's bad. It's just like um, like doll rooks holy. Nice treasure because the thing is is like right right now you spend uh quite a lot eventually you're gonna start to taper off and so that we're just gonna um I, i'll write this in order actually so we can uh we know what in what order we want to start uh removing things so holy so i would say like wheels wheels for comms you want is gonna be like 140k per month we're gonna say holy knights treasure Treasure. Uh, it's gonna be like 50k. We're just gonna 100 spin that. We love that event. It's really good. Um, we're gonna say uh, weekly VIP materials is pretty solid. Your VIP 18, so I want to say it's like 96,000 a month, something like that. Um, okay. We're gonna cool. say as for old. We're gonna say double stone puzzle box. Um, I want to say. Dark's puzzle box is like either slightly less efficient or slightly more efficient than VIP materials. If you're buying VIP materials, I would also buy Dark. Um, the one that's really shitty by comparison is probably Esmeralda's house, but even that is like shitty in the in the scheme of like it's not as good as either of them, but it's not like that bad. It's still better to pick up than than uh, weekly sculpts, I would say. Okay. Um, so we'll say. That'll be like 80k a month. We'd say like um I would prefer to get weekly sculpts before I'd get weekly speeds though. And then uh like the after. Uh I'll put a little question mark there for just how much you feel like spending that week. Um but yeah, basically just every event I'd pick up and then I'd probably uh if you're gonna tone anything down, it'd be toning down the VIP shop instead um okay cool all right uh now that i have now that i've i've intrometido uh how do i put it now that i've been nosy uh let's uh check out your commanders okay um okay so what what are the five marches that you're running right now uh right now let's see sorry i use presets so it's easier to just show you hmm. um Mina CC, uh, Martel YSG, Aethel JC, um, Mehmed Sun, and Richard Jones. But I, that was during KVK1. I plan on switching it up, uh, adding Saladin and Alex, and eventually Constantine into the mix. Okay, let me see the um, let me see the gear sets on this. Yeah. Uh, so that's. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Okay. I, you know, I was a little fucking nervous when you were saying I was running Mehmed Sun Tzu. I got it. So you're. So right now you're not going to be a garrison leader, but later on you're going to be. I assume. Yeah. Got it. Yeah. Okay. Cool. 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 I, I was during KVK one. Got it. I didn't know that they. I didn't know the leadership set came out uh, pre sock. I thought the leadership set was uh, post, but. Good. This is a good set. Um, okay, so this is your your Mehmed. 
set. Yeah, I, I don't have um I don't have the blueprint for the shoes for him, so that's I just kind of left it. Yeah, you're, um, this is this is this looks good. I would not be concerned with this. Yeah. Um. Cool. We love this set. Cool. Cool. Check mark. Out of fifth. Yeah. Oh, sorry. I'll I'll go back. Okay. Okay. And then let's go to the Richard. Yep. Okay. Richard set is rough, but that's fine because we don't know what the meta is gonna look like by the time you get in the sock. Um. Okay. Let's see the uh the Mina CC. Okay. Okay. Cool. Um, usually I don't like to set stuff too much, but you spend a lot, so being able to <laughs> I kind of refine this is totally fine. Um, it's not not too big of a deal. Um, so let's look at the Ethel Flood. Yep. Okay. She rough, but I just didn't know what to do with her, and I didn't want to build a second leadership uh, set that's gold. Yeah, no, no, of course. I would say. Um... Okay, so you had the the Richard set. Do you have any other sets that you're planning yeah, on putting? I, I actually have a couple. Okay. Um, I got this guy. I got this, and I think one more. I don't remember. Uh, here, let me just do the easy way. Um, see, Pyrus has something on him, so I'm gonna check him. Yeah, that's about it. Okay, so we have the second we have the second cab set that we're looking for uh, to slot onto. Uh, we have the second cab set we're looking to slot onto the Saladin, I presume. Uh, so I was thinking of moving Mina's uh, set onto Saladin, and I'm trying to figure out like how I want to um, work into. So right now I I have my gear and I'm gonna use what I can for KVK two, but eventually. I'm trying to set it into. I'm trying to make the sets with SOC in mind. Mm -hmm. So uh, that's a weird position to be in right now. Um, I have extra windswept, but that's for Marauders. Sure. Um, when that. For Marauders, when that happens. Yeah. Okay. Um. Okay. So the the way I see this is. I mean, you have a good amount. So, are you getting MGEs as well, um, or who's where, where are the the MGEs going for your kingdom? Um, yeah. So I I set the MGEs, and I mean, fairly, of course. Uh, for specific meta commanders for each, you know, KVK, I'm going to take whatever I need, um, myself and my buddy, um, BC, he's the other, uh, native with me that we were the garrison and rally leads for, you know, KVK1, and we plan on maintaining a decent level of spending going to SOC. We're no longer, uh, the rally and garrison leaders because of the migrants, uh, with better accounts. Mm -hmm. Uh, in the meantime, we're just building up, um, what we can with MGEs. Because I, I look oh. at, sorry, do you? Yeah, go ahead. Uh, I, I would say the way I, I look at this account, I, I see probably two paths. Like one, you could invest into, you know, the, the 5551 Saladin and the Expertise Alex, right? Which is a like 1090 scope investment. Um, and then you'd, you'd take your second cab set, you'd run something like um, Saladin Ethel, you'd have um, Alex YSG, you'd have uh, Martel Sun Tzu, and then you'd have like Mehmed and you know, we we'd, we'd figure out like some something for maybe it'd be like Mehmed or like Barca, like maybe some weird or Mehmed JC. But the point is there'd be a a march for it. Um However, um with your current uh the current gear you have is frankly like excellent. Um and so you'd have enough you'd you'd find yourself in a weird position where you have more gear than you have commanders. Um yeah. if you if you invest a lot here. Whereas, like, if you get into sock with, like, 2,000, 2,500 sculpts, you could basically immediately, like, as soon as you hit sock, this is what I would see happening, right? You get into KVK3, you see the cav wheel immediately, right? You have um, two cav sets, so right now you have the the set weapon, set helm for one set. For your second set, you would just go for, um, you would not equip it, right? Yeah, you'd have, like, an expedition helm and, like, a Heart of the Saint, or, or uh, Lost Trial, either way. 
um yeah. and you'd be you'd be sitting on on a gold set without those two then you'd replace them with the kvk set as soon as you get there so the first wheel you see you pick up nevsky joan qb and the new cab commander right you have your two uh cab sets immediately for it but that's going to immediately cost you you know 2800 sculpts off for it then the next wheel that comes up you're going to be looking for uh, and it's not going to be 2,800 sculpts, you know, you might be 100 spinning it, you might be max spinning it, just to make sure you unlock all the commanders, and it might look like something like 186 spin. And then you can get yeah. those commanders, right? You don't necessarily, like, um, Nevsky could possibly be like a 5551, five, Joan could be a 5115, right? And then your next wheel is going to be your infantry wheel, then you pick up another 100 spin, then you're looking for, like, Scipio LC, right? Then you use your, both your cap sets, use your imp set, everything is is pretty solid, um, and then, you know, maybe like a KVK or two after that, then you can start putting your leadership stuff to work. But the way I look at it, um, I would be, uh, I'd be, I'm skeptical about investing in KVK two, just cause like if your migrants are going to be doing the heavy lifting for rally Urison for you, um, yeah. I would prefer to see you save these sculptures and then transition really smoothly in. Cause your transition, like if you had Alex, like Alex pairs with LC Saladin, I'm sure like we could do something with him. Um, yeah. But having like being able to thug it out for one KVK without uh which without to be fair, without the strongest marches in there, um, would be really good for your account for your transition, but you it would suck for KVK too. It all depends on the quality of your migrants, I would say. Yeah, we our migrants are pretty good. We we have some really strong accounts. Uh but just knowing me and my competitiveness, I will max out each Saladin wheel until he's five 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 one. And I want to max out Alex. Uh, I'm not going to use gold heads on them, uh, obviously, but I will try my best to max out the wheels. Um, I know Alex is going to be kind of hard pressed to be uh, expertise. Uh, we'll see where that goes, but I kind of want to have those commanders in my pocket in case I can use them. Um, I'm going to be focusing open field a lot. Mm, I I could see the Saladin. I think it would be a lot more. Uh, I, I could I could come down on a lot more just because like I would say three three wheels would probably get you like a little past five five one one so you'd only have to invest like on 120 sculptures to get them to five 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 one which yeah is like a pretty good thing and you have a good cap set um, the Alex on the other hand like that dude is going to that is going to bend you over with the price that price is going to be super expensive and it's like a five hundred thousand. Uh, gem invest it's actually it's more expensive because for the normal player would be five hundred thousand. for you to be looking more like 700 uh 700 or 900k uh worth of gems that the the bigger issue is not um the gem costs actually it would be that you don't have the time to you can't throw enough uh gems at the game to get the sculptures you need before sock um i think the the saladin could be good um be, especially if you're going through the wheels especially if you're looking at it away where you you spin the wheels and you put the specific heads into Sally and you take the universal heads and you kind of squirrel them away, um, and also like a like a five five one one or like a five 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 one Alex is still going to be decent, but I mean he does need that he does need that expertise to to be you know fire because that that is what yeah. makes the the Alex YSG march. Um, I get you. Yeah. Um, I personally. I have Alex expertise, so I mean, like, I understand exactly what you're going through. <laughs> it's not like, it like, it's not like I say this and I'm like, I'm like, oh, like that's crazy. Like, I would never do that. Like, no, I, I did that exact shit. Um, I did on both of my accounts actually. Uh, but yeah, I mean, okay, so let's say you're going for the Alex. So if you're making, if you're putting Alex and Sally in here, we look at something like Mina CC with your secondary set. So with secondary set with no uh, set rep plus helm. Then we looked at we'd say Alex YSG with the with the green set with primary set. Um, I think we just have I think we'd have Ethel as a primary. I think Ethel JC is probably not a bad uh, march, but I I'd, I'd want to see the leadership set on the Ethel JC. Um, yeah. Um, I, I did end up having to do that because. Um the kvk1 kingdom that we fought um they were on par with uh, my accounts and my um my friends accounts so we had a really rough uh k1 mm -hmm. and for all intents and purposes like 
I was having positive trades all around, but Mina CC, um, Mehmed, and um, Ethel ended up dying way too fast um, for my liking. I was getting one on one trade uh, using Ethel. Uh, sometimes I was getting one on one trade, sometimes even worse using Mina CC uh, and Mehmed because there was just, they were strong too, and there were a lot of them. Um, whereas I was getting like between between one to five, one to five to one to ten trade, I was like, you know, two, three million KP to like 200,000 KP using Charles and using Richard, um, like Richard Joan, or sometimes I'll sub out Joan with um, Sun Tzu, and I was getting extremely positive trades, but I, w I wasn't getting the good trades to my liking using Mina, using Aethel, or uh, Mehmed. Okay, then let's let's try uh, Sally Ethel then. Um, that's a, yeah. a pretty classic uh, march. Uh, we'll put the primary set on that. Um, and then nobody's really going to be looking to hit Sally anyway. Um, <laughs> what? Uh, yeah, and I'm also going to be probably trading off with my buddy on first and second place for the Constantine wheel. So... Potentially, we should be able to get him five five one one. He's, mm, he's not bad. I I don't know. I'm not I'm not a huge Constantine fan, but he's. I, so you'd be running? Would it be Constantine Joan or Constantine Milan? Would you be running? Uh, I think I should be able to get Milan expertise for that thirty percent. Um, or you know the extra fifteen percent stats, but. It's I don't sure. know. Yeah, I've 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 heard uh, good things about this march uh, early. You're just getting her from like dailies, right? Yeah. Cool. Uh, I have not spent anything on her. Yeah, I mean we could do like cons Mulan and put in like the second with secondary and set, um, and then we'd have the leadership set looking something like because I'd probably want to run. Um, we could run like Martel Sun Tzu almost because I or Martel. You could run Martel Sun Tzu or Martel Mehmed, whichever one trades better. Um, yeah. With the leadership set, I just I would not run um, Mehmed as the primary. I'd just run like straight imp with the with the Martel, and I think it'd be better off. Um, oh. hmm? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm listening. Okay, Martel. Sorry, you're cutting out a little bit. So like, uh, sometimes you'll say like like uh, something like an agreement, but I'll think you're starting a sentence, which is why I keep asking you. Um, no, you. Okay. Um, my phone does that. I'm I'm on my phone. Um, when I run Rock with Discord, it it messes up sometimes. If you want, I can um, hang up and open up the call again. No, no, you're fine. It's not it's not that bad. Um, okay. Okay. Uh, Mina CC, Alex YSG, Sally Ethel, Constantine Milan. Okay, and I'm um, so if we uh, skip Alex, so like in a dimension where you guys. Uh, are way bigger than your opponents, or you have really, really good migrants, or you decide uh, that Alex is not the move, uh, we should make one of those sets as well. Because uh, I think Saladin would always pick up, just because it's so easy to get from wheels, but Alex would be maybe more of a more of a thought, in my mind anyway. Um, yeah. SG. So Mina CC would have, so we'll say Whip, Primary, Set, we'll say Martel YSG with Primary Set. Um, Sally Ethel, I think it's really solid. I really like that march, actually. Um, that, that march was, like, that used to be my favorite march, like, four years ago. <laughs> Way really? back in the day. Yeah, uh, that march, because I, I've never gotten Salad on any of my accounts, because he's never been good enough for the hyper late game, but that march, because it, they both have, a, a counterattack damage reduction, <clears throat> so if you yeah. put that with, like, a Delanes, um, and the way, like, damage reduction stacks in the game, it's all additive. And Saladin also has access to Buckler Shield. So you have like 9 plus like 7.5 plus like 20 plus 20, I believe. Counterattack damage reduction. And so if he's not getting oh. targeted, like he's just not never taking any damage, which no, no, nobody wants to target Sally anyway. Yeah, I get you. That's um, really good. I didn't think about that. Say, so Richard's expertise. Um, you know, we said Martel Mehmet up here. I really like Martel, but at the same time, like Richard's expertise is probably too good to not run. 
Um, yeah. Yeah, I think it might it might just have to be Richardson too. That feels so weird benching Martell and Ahmed, but I think it's probably the play. Um, or it could just be Richard Martell. Yeah, probably Richard Martell. We'll say that because we want him to be faster with the leadership set. Yeah, that works. Uh, we'll say okay, so we skip Alex, so we're running Richard, and then you're getting Constantine, so it's gonna be Richard. Uh, Sun Tzu so with secondary. What's up? Uh, it sounds like I need to craft a third um, infantry set then. Yeah, I would just use the leadership set. Um, I think okay. That, yeah. Just put the leadership set on Const or, or on Constantine or Richard, whichever one, um, whichever one you want to trade better. Stick the infantry set, and whichever one you know you you don't really care about getting punched up a little bit, you know, put the leadership set on. Um, okay. Let's say Richard get leadership because he's. Um, well, yeah, because he's always been my punching bag. Okay. And no one wants to target him anyway. True. Very <laughs> true. Um, yeah, so I would say... So this would be my, my pairings if I had Alex, and these would be my pairings if I didn't have Alex. Yeah. Personally, I don't know. This this second... the the Looking at the marches again without Alex, it looks pretty damn good. I mean, Alex is awesome. Don't get it twisted. Um, but being able to save 700 sculpts would be really good. Food for thought. Um, either way, should be fine, though. Um, yeah. So in terms of gear, so we'll say we want a second cav set, and we're going to be looking for a cav set chest, Navars, cav set boots, part of the saints, and then I would uh, swap out that windswept for an expedition helm. Okay. Um, and then I would say hold off on ash of the dawn unless you have a lot of extra mats you got a lot of extra materials the ash of the dawn is fine it's just ash of the dawn is not that much better than gladiator and you don't have enough iconic crystals to just throw it on anything so the ash of the dawn is yeah. like you're, you're going up like a percent and a half um so not too big of a deal um i'd say for like inf set um running the same go can you go back to your inf set? i'm pretty sure it's just perfect looking right there's nothing wrong with it uh yeah running the same inset is is fine i wouldn't go for eternal night though i'm pretty sure your your talented carax ability is going to be better than untalented or un iconic uh eternal light um so I'd, i would actually uh swap that out for now uh until you get to uh a, a position to where you kind of iconic it okay um Eternal Knight is going to be worse than, worse than Humility until Iconic. Um, it might be Iconic first for fine, actually. Uh, uh, Kyrish Humility is just like an excellent piece. Um, so, same if set times two. Okay, and then for the leadership set, it's fine. And then I would just, in terms of building like an archer set, right now, I'm be super honest. I have no fucking idea what's going on with the meta with uh, with archer sets right now. Um, some people are running the so if you were to use an archer set, you kind of cannibalize your leadership set. You'd run something. It'd, it'd be like some people are running like Milky Way with like leadership pants, gloves, and boots. Some people are running Dragon's Breath plate with Dragon's Breath boots with the pants and gloves. Um, the point is, is like the pants are definitely getting used for archers. You can definitely find use for them in season of conquest on your archer march um, and the gloves. Yeah could definitely there there could definitely be a spot um i just wouldn't i wouldn't think too hard about it for now um once you get the leadership boots here you'll have like a bunch of pieces that can also go on your archer set um yeah and archers aren't going to come until i believe it's either right during your kl or after it anyway and you know it's always been like a very finicky part of the meta um so i just focus on the cabin infantry um second cap set second infantry set uh finish off your leadership set as you're going to need it for sock um and yeah, you should be fine. I mean, everything else looks pretty solid. Um, oh yeah. Do you have any uh, any anything I didn't cover, perhaps? Um, nothing that comes to mind. Um, yeah, like I said, I didn't go for uh, archers just because I didn't have an archer skin. I I went for calves because I won the uh, fifteen percent calf zenith, and then I won the um, fifteen percent infantry zenith but there was just no like nothing for me to get you know to work on 
archers because I wasn't getting lucky on the wheel or the gold keys. I just got lucky on his armaments, but that's about it. That that is so ironically enough, being unlucky on that is the luckiest shit ever. Like the archers, like Alex will find use in sock, Saladin might find use in sock, Martel finds use, Richard finds use. All these marches like have some kind of future, albeit grim. Archers are truly the shittiest. Like pre sock yeah. archers are so, so bad. Um, and the gear is so hard to translate because you you get archers so so deep in a sock. So um, no, you definitely, ironically enough, no, you got super lucky not investing in that. That's that's very funny actually. I'm glad. <laughs> I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm glad you did not get lucky on that. Um, okay. Uh, so one thing I will say, uh, funny enough, is that uh, we had a one v three kvk one. And one of my buddies did expertise that most. He dropped like a million gems into gold keys and managed to uh, expertise his Thutmose. And his Thutmose uh, YSG rally came in clutch. We were getting like uh, 50 million to like 20 million um, trades using uh, doing his rally. Yeah, so... yeah. Thutmose YSG with the six piece is abhorrent it's a it's a pretty disgusting uh it's a pretty disgusting rally but yeah that's that's something generally um generally it's something you have to like if you're gonna run archers you plan it um like from the start of your account because i remember i coached a couple whales where we we skeletoned out their jump uh ahead of time and they went for the thumbmost yshi um that's also a it's like a if you have good field then the thumbmost yshi will just like pull everything apart the pair of pliers that's <laughs> terrifying a, a million gems for gold keys is so so painful but if it you, know, you guys win kvk one yeah we uh so we got pushed out uh from kingsland mm -hmm. and then we're like hey we're gonna defend our our level seven passes just try to stop them from getting our herons and getting our holy sites and Due to some diplom uh, diplomacy issues with uh, the opponents kind of taunting us and our guys wanting to like make a final push uh we said fuck it we'll make a push and i don't know like we focused um one one kingdom at a time we burned our our own flags we deleted our own flags that touched uh the opposite side focused one side and then focused the other um and it so happened that like these guys were staying up the same amount of time we were. We're like we're staying up thirty six hours at a time, and they were, I guess, burned out. Like they they had to like shut down at some point, and it just so happened it hit their off time when we caught the zig, and we their entire like um, territory went gray, and we just zeroed every single city, and they couldn't recover from that because they were just offline. Uh, we zeroed one of their best fighters. Uh, he was at the start of KVK one. He was about a hundred mil. They and use, wait, they used the zig to connect territory. So, um, yes and no. Um, I, I guess yeah. Well, because their entire territory wrapped around the zig, and when we got all this citadel, like right here, we touched everything. Uh, around their zig so we just burned about 12 flags at the same time and it burned out everything um like from our pass they they covered our entire like this upper corner was just all them and when we burned down at the zig it turned everything gray up top and that's where the majority of their cities were and we got to zero all of them i'd have to be fucking consoled after that all right well i mean that's that's good that's a that's a dub that's crazy as fuck um yeah all right cool well damn sorry um no no, no you're fine you're fine uh what's oh oh uh, if i were to give you a grade um what's uh what's the what was the budget for the account overall uh thus far fuck man um about seventy thousand. Mm, 70k you've got uh what are your debts Oh, yeah, sorry, one sec. No, you're good. Uh, I'm pretty sure I saw, I saw an account actually literally the spitting image of this uh, in a private session, um, which is that, crazy. 
I know who that is too. Uh, yeah. Oh, that's him. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's yeah he he yeah. I I would say he he scored higher than you. I would. I, no. I would say. Uh, let's see. Like we can't. We yeah. We can't find our. Yeah, it's funny. Yeah, because with the with the budget he uh uh with the budget he he gave me versus the budget you gave me, I'd probably give you a five. I think I gave him like a six or a seven. Six point five. Yeah. 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 Uh, <laughs> we had, um, you know, fucking deads and. All right. In my defense, he opened field a lot more than I did. <laughs> yeah, I mean, so. it's it, the accounts are the the accounts uh, have different goals, so uh, that is true. Um, well, I, I also, and if you, you know, uh, I answered a few questions this, but if you have like other questions or something, you know, don't be shy about it. Just you know, let me know what's up. Um, yeah. Then uh, yeah, shoot, shoot me a PM. But uh, yeah, you should be pretty solid. Is there is there anything else that you were uh, curious about? No, I I think that's about it. That's um that's all I got. But one thing though is that I wasn't taking notes during this because I'm on my phone and oh yeah, I'm, it's like... in our DMs. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, dude. That's that's all I got, really. Um, oh, uh, can you check my armaments? Just because I don't think we covered that. I it's it's kind of rough because you know I'm a native and we don't really get the best armaments. Yeah, we can uh, we can look them through. I, I would say generally as a as a rule of thumb, um, what I do with armaments is I every time I get an inscription, I will I'll do like a one stone roll for them, and so I'll, I'll one stone roll three times if I look for like. Um, I'm looking for like a like a 1.6 to 2 percent damage. Um, yeah. Or I'm looking for a 3.5 defense stat is pretty decent. Uh, 3.5 health stat is okay. Uh, the reason okay. why I look for the defense stat is because with the the way things roll, um, your uh, your second row can either roll movement speed or defense. Your top row can roll movement speed or attack, and your bottom row can roll health or damage. Uh, because the second and first roll uh, share movement speed, but you can only have one movement speed. Um, if you roll a 3.5 defense, that means you have double the chance to roll a movement speed to roll like a troop specific one on top. Um, oh shit! So I. Will... Uh, sorry, uh, I did not know that. So, could you like write that down because that is like news to me, and I would, I need to explore that a little more. So if so, armaments. So if you see, um, if you so, when seeing a new script with trash stats, re-roll three times min to with one stone to to look for stats. Uh, these stats could be. 1.6 to 2 percent damage could be 3.5 percent death. You want to death to uh, so your top stat can have two rolls. Those could be also. This is spitballing. This is not. We don't have. You know, the devs have not gone into this. But as far as I know, that's how it is. To the best of my knowledge. Um, attack or movement speed. Yeah. Um, Sorry. 3.5 health on the bottom is not a bad stat by any means, but I would be more hes hesitant, hesitant to roll it versus damage like if i saw like 1.6 damage to two percent damage on the third roll generally like 1.8 to 2 is probably better 1.6 is a little low but 1.8 to 2 damage on the bottom i would i'd be rolling that all day just because then it doesn't matter what troop type you roll it for you know everything is going to want the, the all damage on the bottom and that might be something where you want to put a special inscription on it i got um, you but yeah every time i see um i see it again these are my my gut tells me you know uh seven um so three rolls on like something with trash stats and if you get a stat you want or two stats you want then i consider rolling it from seven if you see one stat you want you can roll it a couple more times down to five for three stones a piece 
Um, and if you see two stats you want, then obviously you're gonna wanna roll it all the way down um, if you're really uh, interested in, in preserving those stats. Um, but mostly the name of the game is every time you see an inscription, roll it a couple times just to see it like as much as you can um, to see if you can, uh, you know, you can turn trash or treasure. Uh, it's gonna be your best bet, yeah. Gotcha. Um, did you have any questions about your armament specifically? Um, no, I was just seeing like um, what you you would rate like the armaments. What I could, what I should keep, and what I should change out if I see something better. Um, so I would run probably all your marches. I would run um, wedge on, except for maybe like if you had something. Because the thing is, is like every time you get an armament, I would almost always just toss it straight into wedge uh, as a rule of thumb, just because you're always gonna need more wedge. Uh, until yeah. you've like maxed, like gotten like great wedge stats, then I would consider moving uh, moving to like one arch and maybe um, I'd just go to arch. I wouldn't go to echelon. Um, and you know, just like if you have like plus five stats on a wedge thing, I'd rather have that than than like minus five stats. I, I mean, minus five stats on an arch for like a, a smite is probably not bad. But um, mm -hmm. okay, the the infantry one looked okay. This one's looking pretty rough. Are you running this for inf or are you running? Um it was mainly for imp. That's what I used her for. But like I said, um, I'm I haven't really gotten the best uh, armaments, so it's kind of what I can do right now, especially since I'm lacking transmutation stones. Mm -hmm. So yeah, it's it's rough. Um, I'm using what I can get. Really, that's the big thing. Yeah, I just think anything you roll, you just slot in. Um, I'd also be uh, more. Uh, I don't know how often you look at the the blue, uh, the blue ones that pop up, but yeah, you, know, you can get like blue pieces that might give you like five percent total stats, something like that, if you get a triple roll on it. Because um, even oh, yeah. I, even I, when I started with armaments, uh, I was running blues for a little bit. Um, they're a little better than you might think, but and overall, like, there's not, there's there's nothing too much about like getting lucky or not lucky. You know, it really is. Uh, rolling it the infantry set looked pretty good the cavalry set i mean like you're brand new to armaments so yeah you know, it, it doesn't look too bad um but again i mean you're just looking for whatever raw stats you can find so if you can find inscriptions generally like any inscription that gives you like 3.5 or 2.5 worth of stats with like one or two stats of your desired is is like fine right i would not yeah. overthink the uh don't overthink the inscriptions just how many stats can i stuff in these commanders and call it a day yeah okay Sweet man, that's uh, I think that should be everything. Um, all right, cool. But uh, yeah, you know, if you have any other questions, just be sure to shoot me a PM, something like that. Um, but yeah, we're all you know, pretty good sesh, and you know, good luck on your KVK2, man. Sweet, thanks, dude. All right, see you around. Bye. All right, all right, let us lower the desktop audio. All right, guys, we are back. <clears throat> hey, what up, Blade? How you doing? Welcome back, man. 89 watching and 54 likes. Yeah, by the way, if you guys don't mind hitting a couple likes, I'd appreciate that. Hey, shout out to 007. I appreciate uh, you gifting a sub. Uh, shout out to uh, Cray Sip. She Cray Shep. Enjoy your, uh, your sub, man. Hey, thank you so much, guys. Again, y'all, every single donation helps a ton. Um, thank you so much for your donations. Oh, shout out to Blade. I didn't even see you were in here. How you been, man? It's been a while since I've seen you around. What'd he say here? Three months, let's go. Let's go, man. How you been? Looking sharp. Been a minute. Those are some gains I see. Yeah, we are. How's your mom? How's your dad? How's the 12 doing? Everything's, you know, we're doing we're doing all right. I'm not gonna lie. You know, life ain't, ain't been, uh, you know, has not been S tier. Um, but, uh, you know, we're doing all right. Everything is, uh, everything's improving a little bit. Glad to see you here again, man. Extra using Saladin? Well, I, I wouldn't say extra using Saladin. I said 55551. Five, five, all right, let's see what's up. The guy was playing his best Lexus in the cities, bro. I can't believe when he described that. I realized, I realized how they set up their territory, yo. And this is why I tell people I can't do territory, right? Like, if you ask me, that's some shit I would do. I have no idea what's going on with territory, bro. I would be, I'd be so pissed. I, dude, I'm sure that came to exploded afterwards. Holy shit, that is. That's one of the worst fumbles I've ever heard in my life. They didn't backflag. 
So they had one line of flags, and he just burnt the whole thing, and everything turned gray. I'd have a seizure, bro. I would have an absolute... You'd see me doing the kick and chicken. I'd be on the floor doing the juice world. The Cameron Boyce, if you will. Holy God. Bro, one row? He burned one row of flags to zero the entire kingdom? Bro, I'd die. I would die. I'd think about that. Dude, I wouldn't be able to go to sleep for, for years without thinking about that moment. Dude, I can't imagine what their Discord looked like. Ugh. Bro, I honestly, that, that makes me want to cry. Dude, him saying that, like when he got to the, oh yeah, like I, we burned one row and everybody died. I was like. <clears throat> you gave me a 6-0 on roast because of my Saladin, now you're recommending it to him? I want a 7-0? That guy got a 5. <laughs> He got a five, Diego. He got a his account got a five. What do you mean? Diego's like <laughs> Diego. <laughs> he got a five. Oh, is this somebody in my general chat that's about to get banned? Ah, ah, ah. Ah, ah, ah. I love banning people that just drop shit. Ban for cringe. Ah, we got him. Ah, banning for cringe, bro. Never gets old. They backflagged the row. There were points where they had five flags in one spot. Really? They backflagged it and they, they lost everything? Well, okay. Now I feel a little less bad about them. Oh, so you guys just beat the shit out of them. You just you beat the tar out of them one day? Decided you had enough? Damn! 10 USD in Super Chats, my boy. Thank you so much, Jackie. I appreciate it. Typhoon Man, what up? Welcome back. Eating tamarind candy. Thank you. Have a little extra for me. Pretty pleased. Mohid, welcome. Alex. Damn. Okay. 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 That's tight. Oh, and you rally, you punch through, because if they didn't have enough people to fill, then that, that thought most why she was probably just assaulting them. Did they not have the garrison on? Was that the biggest issue? Cal lasting seven days for KVK1 is disgusting. Hey, Zaza, Carls, welcome. Glad to have you guys here. Welcome to the stream, boys. The most YSG is a monster rally. It depends if you have field. It greatly depends. The most YSG is a rally that can get swarmed down intensely. If that rally gets swarmed, bro, it is it is toast. That march can, that rally can get spread. Uh, I mean, super super candid. Uh, but if it's not getting swarmed, it, then it's doing well. It's just it's a very vulnerable rally. I'm feeling a bit well. I spent 98 for the league. You gave me a six. Well, to be fair, it's proportional to spending, right? Like if he, if he was free to play, he'd, he'd get like a like a 50 out of 10. Why don't you heal out of 10? Jackie casually chatting in super chats. Well, I mean, he's got it like that. Okay, look, not 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 all of us have such a you know such wealth. You know, me me personally, bro, I don't think I've ever donated or super chatted a streamer ever. I don't think I've I've, I've ever done it. Maybe I've done it one time with uh. uh Oh, I got messages.
Based. Alright, uh, why don't you heal all? Because the reason why you don't heal all is because, um, your, your troops will finish healing really fast, and then you don't have to heal, like, my troops will heal instantly like this, versus if I heal all, then it'll take more time. Getting zeroed, but I thought that was why I shouldn't KVK one was my worst nightmare. True, what up, Owen? My 23 mil account was an archer main? I love you too, buddy. Uh, their KD ran out of troops. Their whale started between 70 and 100 mil, and they're all 55 to 60. Damn, okay. Heat. You're one of the first I joined memberships, but other than that, it's been zero on anywhere else. Well, the thing is, I'm I'm actually, I'm just poor. <laughs> I'm just, I'm, I'm too poor to be donated, people. Thank you, thank you, Jackie. Hey, I really appreciate it. Again, guys, look, we are sponsored by Rock. The only reason why we're full-time, though, is because very generous people like Jackie. Without people like that, bro, there would be no full-time stream. So, shout out to the homie. Thank you so much, man. Swarming a Thumbos YSG with full legendary gear hurts, uh, for me at least. It well, it depends. I, I'm talking about obviously whales. Um, you know, you, you're if you're T4 and you're you're touching it, then you know you're you're probably getting diddled. Oh, gather through runes. Hey, okay, Balkan poor. We struggle to breathe. That's true. Well, you're Balkan poor with Balkan prices, though. Also, it depends on what type of Balkan. You know, some of uh, some of the upper crust Balkans out here. Kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm joking. I'm joking. Okay, guys. Everybody, everybody put put the put the Molotovs down. My Balkans. My bad. Would you eat a tamarind shaped dick? I'm crying. Uh that rally slaps everyone that tries to swarm in 10 mil power. Yes. If you're 10 mil power, you're trying to swarm, then yeah, you're probably getting shit on. Serbia Balkan? I'll have you know, Serbia is my third favorite Balkan country. Now, the countries above Serbia that I have is my first and second. You probably would not be a huge fan of, but, you know. Your third favorite. You're above Greece. Peep your Discord DMs? Let me see what's up. See what we got going on here. Three hundred and forty-one million deads, bro. Holy Christ! And three billion kills, though. That is wild. That's a wild, wild. That's a lot of fucking deads, bro. Holy shit, for KVK1. I want to say, so, like, for context, I want to say 1365, for the last KVK, we got 2.5 billion. But, like, we have, we have, like, farms and shit. You know what I mean? And we didn't have the domain system. Um, so, just proportionally, that's, that's quite, quite a, quite a number. Damn. Hey, thank you again for the uh, super chat, man. I appreciate it, by the way. Helps a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot. A lot. Jesus Christ, though. Portugal, number two? Do we consider Portugal to be a Balkan country? What, f what isn't the Balkans? He's like, Ukraine's a Balkan country. Russia's a Balkan country. And Germany's a Balkan country. What do you think, personally, is the best uh, KD leadership style? Probably two alliance. Uh, one, to, one to two alliance is generally pretty good. Probably two. Oh, favorite country overall? Oh, no. I know that I don't like Portugal. Don't be racist towards the rest of the world. One day I will step foot in the Balkans. Tony hates everyone else. True. We have found out, boys. <clears throat> it's always nice to see like good, good like heavy whale accounts, though. Uh. 
Um, especially ones that, that are like that are formatted well, bro. Holy shit! When it comes to um, dude, because the leadership gear, because dude, I'm not gonna lie. When he said he had leadership gear, or, or no, 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 my bad. Before he said leadership gear, he said he was running. Uh, because whoever whoever is helping him out did him right. Usually whales get absolutely horrifically dog shit advice. So when he said he had uh, Mehmed Sun Tzu, I was like, oh, I was like, this is about to be dog shit. And then he whipped out the leadership gear because I saw the gear on it and I thought for sure it was about to be infantry gear, talented for leadership. And I was about to have a seizure. And then it wasn't. It was leadership gear. And I was like, oh, I was like, he's he knows what he's doing. I was like, that's great. Why that skin? This one? I have no idea. I think it looks cool. No problems. Thanks for the coaching. We're ways away. I'd like to build a kingdom that people recognize just by numbers. You know, many people try. Um, some people succeed. Many fail. Um, but you guys are, I mean, you know, if you got leadership like you, the biggest thing is trying to avoid burnout, right? Uh, a guy a guy that I would talk to if I were you about um, that you might be able to, to look for from advice is a guy named uh, Psycho. Um, Psycho has, he, Psycho does not have the best reputation. Because uh, that dude has been trying to make, like, a, a kingdom worth its shit, worth its salt, for, like, two years? Probably about that now? And he's in uh, 3358. Apparently, they just, they absolutely just wiped uh, their KVK. They just annihilated everybody. Um, and they've got, like, a very good KVK2 coming in. Like, they're, they, everything they've got going on looks very solid. Um, I've heard good things about their kingdom. Um, so, they might be a good friend of reference. Just because they, they've got a lot of experience in it. What do you think is the best? A council, a dictatorship, or a dictatorship with a council? Um, it's gotta be dictatorship with a council, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, but no sweat. And again, thank you so much for the donations, man. Thank you. Should I be scared while being in 33 with the 8? that what they're gonna i mean you you better get your account good because if their migration is huge you're, you're not gonna find yourself with uh you'll not be able to find your ass with both hands in the top alliance discord um give me a minute i because I, I don't know if i'm i don't know how many sessions i'm doing today Hey, thank you so much for the 50 RSD. I don't know what these are. Thank you so much for the 50 Serbian dinars. Play like flexing them 50 cents. Hey, I, I'm, I'm rich in Serbian coin now, okay? I'm feeling like Stefan out here. The next 60 GT. The last kingdom that said they were going to be the next 60 GT is just dead now. So let's not curse them. Hopefully, 3358 has a great future. Thank you. Thank you for the super chats, boys. I appreciate it. Our K1 had over 30 T5 players between us and 3324, so it wasn't easy. That's quite a significant margin. Um, I would say, like, if you if you have, like, 15 T5, it's a it's a pretty pretty high number. Um, so, so being able to have 30 in a KVK and have them all be active is really hard. Also, uh, piloting is not very common uh, really early on, so it's hard to keep them online. Yeah, it wasn't easy, of course. I mean, the way you described it. Um, hmm. uh, one more session or not. Let's run it. Let's, let's do it. Yeah, we can do it. Yeah, this works.
Send it, do the session, and buy wings later. Uh, three lines KD can't cry about not being top one, for sure, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Box test, what up, man? How you doing? Yeah, this is gonna be the uh, we're gonna do we're gonna do a session now and then uh, we'll probably uh, we'll probably go get some coffee, write a little bit, and then we'll come back uh, come back later. What's this? Where your girl at? Bro, she's not my girl. I, people are y'all are actually deranged. Okay, me and her are cool. We're chill. I was like, we are not dating. We're not dating. We're not sleeping together. We've never kissed. We've never held hands. Is she a pretty girl? Yes. But we are friends. She is cute, though. She do be cute. Uh, I never like dynasties like GSW, Miami Heat, etc. So I'd hate to see another GT. I I guess. I I mean I I don't know enough about sports to, to for that to make sense to me. Satisfying videos. What's up, man? How you doing? Okay. Okay, boys, I'll be right back. It, uh, that's what she said. It's a joke, right? Is uh, LC5551 good? I mean, it's not bad. Um, I just, I'd either 5511 him or I'd expertise him. I'll be right back, boys. I'm going to the bathroom. Ugh, we're going to do another coaching. I told the guy, yes, you guys get one more session, okay? I was not going to do it, but I've been convinced, I guess. Whoa, almost died. That was close. All right, y'all, let's get this. Let's get this coaching. Let's get this sesh. Let's sesh it up. Ugh. Get some water, actually. Let's get this hydration, okay? Bad day to be dehydrated. It's a bad day to be a parched. Never mind. <sighs> Dying on stream be epic content. Uh, what up, Dino? Do you coach returning players who are going to start over? Uh, I coach anybody. I do sock transitions. I do KVK1, KVK2. I do endgame content. I do uh, pre-jump planning. Uh, anything. If you are going to put money in my pocket, I will coach you. Will there be a stream later? Yep. There will be a stream probably around, I think, 22 UTC at the latest. I just need to, I, like, as soon as I finish coaching, I'm getting the fuck out of this house, bro. I'm getting out of here. I'm going to the coffee shop. I'm writing. I might pick up some Taco Bell. Maybe I'll buy some, uh, some McDonald's. I don't know. I, I'm, 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 oh, dude, actually, no, I can't. I have to cook. Ah, ah, I have to cook food. I have food in my fridge that will go bad if I don't cook it, bro. I'm molding. Okay, what up, uh, Joey? How you doing, bro? My dad sent me the food. I can't let it go bad. Not be responsible with me. Okay. We get our stuff? Nice. All right, boys. It is a coaching session. If you guys enjoy, if you guys enjoy this type of content, please drop a like. Consider subscribing. If you guys want to help support the content, please consider do doing a donation to the Streamlabs link in the description below. That is the number one way to help support the channel. Um, I do not read chat while I am coaching. 
Um, so if you guys like this type of content, or if you guys want your own session, you guys can go to the Discord in the description below and make a ticket. It's 35 bucks for an on-stream session, 75 bucks for an off-stream session. Uh, here we go, boys. Um, I will see you guys on the flip side. Okay, Let's see what's up here. Let's see. Hey man, how you doing? Doing good, how are you? Doing good. Let me turn you up a little bit. Can you say testing, testing? Testing, testing. Hello. All right, that should be good. Okay. Right. Um, do you have a screen share? Yeah. All right. Let's see what you got going on here. Boom, and we've thrown it up. Boom. Yeah, just a little background. Um, <clears throat> I'm supposed to be a free to play player. I mean, I'm going forward. I definitely am, but I've spent approximately probably like two hundred dollars since the start of this account. So fifty day, fifty eight days in, two months. Uh, your stream's frozen. Uh, you might wanna. Oh. Um, I don't know if you're trying to uh, stream the application, but if you stream the display instead, stream. it usually works. Is that good? That works. All right. So right. two hundred dollars looking to be free to play. Say it again. So two hundred dollars looking to be free to play. Yeah. Oh, I, I thought you had, I thought you were going to, I thought you had more oh. context. Uh, yeah, so that's pretty much all. Um, I created this account about two months ago, was looking just to play casually, happened to be in a kingdom where we had a bunch of jumpers, so that's when I like, started to like actually learn more about Rise of Kingdoms, and then I came across your channel, started doing more research. Uh, so I'm in a pretty peaceful kingdom, uh, 3407, pretty much con entirely controlled by like one clan uh but we have three main alliances and i'm in just one of them um yes yeah, so we have a bunch of like pretty knowledgeable people most of them are europe based i think though so i don't really talk too much to them um yeah so just looking at, like general advice i guess more on the commander's base i i don't have a lot of time every single day to play so i'm definitely missing out on like optimization for everything i could be doing um like i'm pretty far behind my commander levels and stuff like that so just looking for general advice to like kind of catch up i guess um i guess for kvk i'm looking for just one pairing right now which is originally going to be yulji sun tzu but now i'm thinking of switching sun tzu out for pyrus um yeah i'm at like five almost five five one one uh yeah um have you damn okay how many heads have you put into pyrus uh so ready to check that uh top left information scroll down 59 okay actually not that bad i thought it was uh, i thought it was worse than that to be honest okay so um so are you going to be are you free to play completely or is, is this mean like 15 bucks a month or like what what are we looking at like um it probably is around like yeah 15 maybe 30 bucks a month um like this this month i was you know buying the daily packs and stuff for pyrus uh getting heads for him um but yeah i, I don't think uh yeah, but 15 is probably like generous it's probably the average okay and how many hours per day do you normally play uh i'd say on average two hours or maybe sometimes three hours it really depends on the day i work like 50 hours a week so uh, whenever whatever time I do get, I try to like at least log on and get you know at least send my gathers out or uh, try to hit the two times that we do the guardians um, here, which just happens to be like 10 a.m. 10 p.m. for me. Um, yeah, so I, yeah, I'd say about like two three hours a day. Um, can you like check your phone every so often during work, or how does that look like for you? Yeah, yeah, I check it every every now and then. Um, <laughs> yeah. So ours, uh, how many farms do you have? I have two farms, but I have not been able to consistently like you know bring up the speed. I'm I'm, I'm pretty lacking behind on them. I, I would do you say. Want me to show you them. Uh, I know it's it's okay. I mean, like, I, I as long as you, because the biggest thing I'm gonna, I'm gonna say here is like, um, 
we're going to go through the coaching session. You're going to get a bunch of information and you know, a yep. bunch of ways to, to optimize your account. The number yep. one thing that has to happen is you have to have at bare minimum three farms and they have to be, uh, they have to be probably like CH 17 by the time you have a KVK one, something like that. Um, mm. and eventually you'll have them in CH 25. So if you have three farms and you can gather on them consistently, like four times yep. a day, something like that, um, you're in a good spot. But that's okay. uh, that's going to be the the number one biggest change that probably comes out of the entire thing. So I'd say okay, uh, need at least three farms minimum will be the biggest change. Um, I would say uh, gathering. So a lot of people talk about gathering gems. Gathering gems shouldn't be considered uh, until your three farms are at least CH seventeen and gathering consistently. Um, okay. Yeah. So we'll say so spending, spending per month. I would say uh, Lucerne scrolls for two fifty a month. It's super super solid. Uh, it's yep. like a five dollar purchase every two months. Um, I would say gem supply. Uh, running you ten bucks is awesome. And then we can just run... yeah. I finished Lucerne for this uh, this time. Nice. And then we'll just say uh, pop ups for legendary sculpts and. Materials, uh, and then just get those as you see them, and we'll call that like thirty a month. Um, yeah, I would okay. say in terms of spending, that's pretty much all you need. In terms of gems per month, um, I would assume you're gonna get something like forty k, some somewhere around that. Um, okay. So forty k gems per month. I would like to see uh, ten spinning wheels or comms you want. Uh, that's gonna run you like. 10k, I think. Yeah. Mm, maybe 11 spinning wheels, but yeah, I'll run you like 10k. We'll say more than gems into VIP, and we'll say like uh, 14k. We'll say 7k a day. Uh, 7k per day, if you find yourself, um, because you're probably gonna have some extra gems uh, from Growth Fund every so often. Um, yourself with extra gems. One day, 25k, second day, second day, 7k, second day, 7k is not a bad idea. Okay. Um, then we're going to say Holy Knight's Treasure, which is the egg event, and we do uh, 10 spin for 5k. Uh, and then that'd be it. That's all, all the places where you spend your jumps. Um, okay. Okay. Next, we're going to look at commanders. So right now, um, I see you have Yulji at 55. Um, 51, yeah. Uh, 51. So Pyrrhus, he is, he is 5 4 one, one. Um, I, I don't think that makes him better than Sun Tzu. But basically, this guy's a wash. The, the sculptures you spent here, sadly, are like wasted, and the dailies are mm. also wasted. Um, he's just not that good of a comm um okay. he's like a whale com at best and once it comes to, to late game he's he's like completely uh uh completely out of here um okay what's your richard at uh five one one okay not bad um we like richard uh and then sun tzu how close is he to expertise uh pretty close 80 sculptures away yeah okay um hmm. so the way i see this how um do you think you could get the XP for Sun Tzu uh, to 60 uh, by the time you hit KBK1? Or A60, uh, level 60 comm? Like, what, what are your, let's look at your stars. Sorry, say that again? Stars? Yeah. The stars is in your, um, your the stars that you use to star commanders. The, the statues. So if you go out of oh. this, go to your bag, and then scroll down. Uh, go to bag, uh, other... Okay, we have, so we need like four or 500 stars. We have not that much time. What we do have is we have a decent amount of gold stars. Okay, um, what the fuck do we need here? So you have time to do guardians. We have gold stars. So there are, there are two ways you can do this. Um, hmm. Yeah, use like a shit ton of these purple stars just for hitting Yulji, uh, five star or six star. Yeah, and I I underestimated how much it actually took. I, I didn't like this. Is my first time obviously hitting someone level fifty, um, so I didn't realize it took that many stars. 
Yeah. My okay, so my point of view on this is there's no way you're gonna be able to get Bjorn or Sun Tzu up in time. Yeah. However, the amount of gold stars you might be able to get Richard up in time might be think? possible. Okay. And then running like a Richard Sun Tzu or uh what level was Pyrrhus? Uh thirty three. Yeah, so I'm thinking the play here would probably be something like Richard. Uh worst case scenario you get Richard to like level fifty and then you chain with him. And you use, like, uh, once you get to KVK1, you use Richard Ethel to chain up, and then you can try and make up for some of the lost um, XP. Uh, okay. I, I, would not be, I would not be leveling or starring anyone that isn't, like, immediately crucial. So, like, so for commanders, like, I think Rich, 5111, uh, Sun Tzu X can work. Um, gathers, get your gathers up to... 37 when possible um in kvk1 you will have to chain with the richard to try and get his levels up so power wise like you're in the top alliance oh yes yeah okay cool how many gold chests are you getting per day uh how do i check that oh by the gifts yeah just um like generally how much do you think you get uh it's hard to say i would say I haven't really been checking, honestly. I th oh, actually, this is not the top type of lines. I think the the ones with the whales are RCN. We have three alliances. Uh... You go to your profile in the top left, and then you go to rankings. It's the the trophies. Yeah, there you go. And alliance power. Yeah, so we're like third. Okay. So and these then... are also alliances, but I'm not okay, in so them. Click on click on the third here. And then click off of that, and then click on the second, and then click on the first. Okay. Fourteen, sixteen. Got it. Okay. And what are the what are the requirements for the first alliance? I have no idea. Honestly, I haven't talked to them about their requirements. I have not uh, looked into joining them. My friends, like the ones I made friends with, are in this alliance. So so far, I've just been sticking with them. And because I don't have time to grind, like I know these guys in the first alliance are, um, like you know, they're always going for MGE and all the other stuff. So. No, I, I mean, uh, you, you can, you, like, it, look, if they, if their requirement is 6 mil, and you have friends in here, you can get in this bitch ASAP. Uh, you okay, start getting I mean, yeah, I'm 7 mil, so. Yeah, so that, okay. that needs to be the, the, the first, first order of business, so, let's go back to the top things. I think gem should be the thing, we'll say, need to get into top alliance ASAP, okay. Uh, KVK1, you're gonna have to chance Richard, okay, that's fine. Um, opening gold chests, okay. We, yeah, we need the, the Richard to get up because I think Richard Sun Tzu is going to be your one march, and then Richard's going to have to. Do you know what barbarian chaining is? Yeah. Cool. Um, yeah, that's going to be your life in KVK one to try and get the account back on track. Uh, let's okay. see. Let's see where your speeds are at. Um. <clears throat> okay, we have. Okay, not too bad actually. This is like what seventy days, something like that. Pretty good. Yeah, something like that, yeah. Um, all right, so whatever you have to do to get in this top line. So generally, so let's say, um, uh, so we're gonna say for gear, um, here I would not overthink this. We're gonna say four piece, uh, wind swept, gatekeepers, shield, and like sentry breaches. Um, don't go for gear until you have an extra 50 mil gold on hand. <clears throat> so in terms of gear, four piece windswept, gatekeeper shield, sentry breaches, slap it on the Richard. Don't overthink it. Huh. We're not gonna build this out though until we get to like KVK1. Um, okay. So let's go to the academy. Yeah, so we're pretty much, um, I, I thought I had engineering 10, but I just realized I didn't. But that's what I focused on and then now I'm going for all the military tech. Okay, close enough. So, uh, so research. Um, get ng10, then ignore econ tree. All right, and then over here, scroll a little bit further to the right. Okay, so little, so little three is gonna be behind cartography. So little three, um, wood steel and scutum are gonna be your troop specifics for the long swordsman. Steel plus scutum, and big three, which is gonna be your final three at the end. Yep. Um, should all be kept around the same level. So, uh, you know, 
finish your other T4s. Uh, the only troop specific text you should ever touch is going to be Wood Steel and Scudum. Everything else is going to be Blocking Arrow, Stirrups, Pavis. They're all going to be one. Um, and so you're going to uh, if the little three is five, Wood Steel and Scudum is going to be five. The big three is going to be five, so on and so forth. Um, it's going to be a good good place to 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 put speeds. So like in terms of like okay. uh, spending speed ups. First thing is I would say the number one place you can spend speeds would be to get power to stay in the top alliance. That's going to be your absolute like most mandatory thing. Uh, getting okay. those gold chests is going to push your account a lot further than any opportunity cost is going to uh, sack you. Also, uh, in terms of the blacksmith, never ever build animal bones. You can build anything but animal bones. Those are the gathering ones and you never want them. Yeah. Okay. That's the only reason I was doing that recently. I was building just the, uh, what's this called? Still, but uh, I realized I didn't. I never built the um, Lohar's own necklace, and uh, I was thinking that that's probably like wasted XP on some of my commanders um, that I could be using. Is oh, that is that actually something I should be prioritizing or no? Um, if you end up getting uh, getting the the bones able to like just through natural means, whether that's like events or or uh, like material chests or anything like that. Um, yeah, that's fine, <clears throat> but I would never build them normally. Okay, it, it's a good All piece. Right. It's just not that good of a piece. Okay. Um, um. Okay. So, so spending speed up. So the number one thing is to get power to stay in the top alliance. Number two would be fifteen percent rune. You know, you get that from the middle. Uh, KD buff. Um, the ten percent KD buff that the king can sometimes drop. Um, you do you guys have a king yet? Have you captured the lost temple? No, not yet. That's uh. I think we're still a couple of days away from that. Okay, so basically the king every so often is going to be able to pay for a kingdom-wide buff. Um, yep. So you're going to want the kingdom-wide buff, a 15% rune, and a title, which they're going to be able to give out for free, all at the same yep. time. When all of those stars align, then you can spend speeds uh, without fear, generally. Um, I would say, like, my third rule here, I would say, like, universal speeds should be considered... To be research speeds um there's very uh few other things that you should be spending any of your universals on what uh city hall are you 22 uh 23 23 nice okay yeah um so in terms of in terms of getting to 25 you want to be 25 before you see combat so there's going to be an, a monument in kvk1 that's going to give you extra uh extra gems if your ch25 by that point that should generally okay. be your benchmark i wouldn't be too concerned about it another thing i would uh not do so not open up your resource packs um just generally uh if somebody goes rogue or something you don't want them to be able to you know beat you over the head and uh steal your shit um so i'd keep okay. your tokens in in token form until you absolutely until you need them um and they, you i mean you'd spend them as spend them as if they're in your pocket but i would not just uh, open them consistently um, right okay yeah for the most part we have a very peaceful kingdom with you know this one alliance you know um so i've been it's been pretty decent in that sense, uh, and then yeah, I'm just kind of like focusing on getting to CH25. So that's what my building is pretty much going to or always is just the next requirement to get there. Like currently, I need scout a uh, siege to 23, and then I can level my CH again. Uh, and then in terms of resources, yeah, like I'm not, I'm never o like over by a lot, so I always need to be gathering. Yeah, and I would, um, I'd also so upgrading the next city hall level is always a good idea, um, and I would also make sure your alliance center is going up as well. Uh, yep. since that's uh, very valuable. Um, yep. My fourth rule for spending speed ups here, I'd call it complete but not compete. Um, so when we're talking about generally like 20 sculpt events or like smaller events like that, um, getting to like top 50 or top 100 instead of going like saving up for like a higher ranking or trying to go for like top 20 or top 10 is generally the yep. move. Like the more okay. top 100 you can get, the better. Um, it allows you to grow like a little bit like here and there. You can get like the small rewards to like subsidize your growth. And you get a sculpture right. in there. So, so would Zenith uh, be one of those events that uh, looking to just complete, not thing? Because I know that this one is a pretty, uh, we got pretty decent. I guess twenty head event, and it's a pretty good reward for the the whole. Um, I don't know if you'd look to get top one hundred here. If you got top one hundred by getting you, you'd be looking to get one mil power, so you can get the the five sculptures because this is going to give you five sculptures regardless, as long as you get a right. mil power um okay so completing the event would be good going for any type of ranking here is probably like account suicide you like you're probably not gonna uh, get it um but like getting the five sculpture is not a bad idea because while zenith is going on you're also gonna have like other events like whether it be mightiest governor whether it be like 20 yep. sculpt events so you're gonna have other 
um, forms of value that you'll get simultaneously. Um, okay. Yeah, but universal speeds to research, complete but not compete, um, and then generally like wait for, for buffs and stuff would be a, a big thing here. Um, okay, so that's going to be that. Your farms are going to be that. Um, what what else have you been uh, struggling with or curious about? Or sorry, before that, um, are you positive? Like, are you in a rising star kingdom? Are you guys gonna win KVK? Or uh, I'm pretty certain we're gonna uh, win KVK. I don't think our kingdom is rising star out of the four. Um, what is this? Yeah. So, oh yeah, we are. Okay. okay. Cool. This this I think it was recently something else, but then it just changed to this recently. So yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'm pretty. I'm pretty certain we have a very like uh, unified alliance or kingdom, and uh, we have some pretty big wells as well. Okay. Have you guys scouted the other kingdoms, or like, do you have information on what the other kingdoms look like? I I don't. I wouldn't know about that. I, if there, we do have people who are like, you know, our our fours are all part of like uh, the management and stuff, so they they might have, but I'm not privy to that information. Okay. I would say if you have uh, like pretty intelligent like friends, especially that are top alliance guys. Yeah. Um, if you see any of them migrate for any reason, just get that information out of them because right about now is when people are going to start uh, leaving if you guys are going to lose. Personally, I might consider... Yeah, making... no, I don't think that's, that's going to happen. Okay, well, I, I would yeah. consider making like a couple uh, a couple accounts if you have time at some point just to look around because the, the other kingdoms have already been unfogged. So if you make yep. an account or two, you can just chill there, look at the rankings, see what's up um and then you know make sure that you're you guys aren't like tiny in comparison um but you okay. guys are the rising star so it shouldn't be a big issue um because i was going to ask about cool. migration okay um yep. comms gear spending farms speed ups okay um so what uh you know what what has been um what have we we not talked about that's been uh cool for you um yeah so main concern was commanders and getting those guys set at least so i know what i'm doing going forward um other concerns it's not too much else i guess uh yeah we talked about i kind of already understand like how to get these heads and stuff and other stuff um uh, yeah you, de you definitely brought up other things that i wasn't really thinking about so like the gear and research um like, I, I knew up to where I am now what I was supposed to be focusing on. For example, you know, the econ getting engineering and mathematics maxed. And then going forward, I just had a, a sense of that I need to start working on the combat. But you gave me a better, like, you know, uh, explanation of what to focus on. Um, yeah, I mean, like, I think that's that's pretty much it, like, for my concerns. Is there anything else that you see that I could be, like, doing differently? Um, I sometimes like we have like more more flowery sessions where it's like you know it can go like in terms of like different um different options. It's just right now you're uh like we have we have probably like one path that ends up like fixing the account, and that's just you know the the Richards on two, the one set of gear, and I'd say the biggest thing is the farms, hands down. If you pull anything from the session, it's that uh you're gonna have three farms and you're log on ambitious like four times a day and you know get them get them to a pretty good city hall because that's good that's gonna be the the biggest like make or break um because people that you see now there might be people yeah. that you see now they're gonna be like decently higher power than you and they're gonna have zero farms and then come like kvk2 kvk3 they're gonna fall off horrifically uh because they have no other way of getting resources yeah okay but yeah i mean that would probably be all my concerns but i mean if you if you're playing and you, you know something comes up and you're like hey like you know what's going on here you can always shoot me a pm um i'm pretty good especially with quick questions i'm pretty fast at responding or oh i guess another thing for commanders wise would be i guess the talent tree um i mean this is kind of what i have for yulji right now and i was told that this is pretty good for open field and um Hunted kingdom um and I see that now joining your Discord, you guys, you have a, a pretty decent bot showing like the pairings and talent trees and stuff. What would be your like recommendation for when I'm I'm trying to like invest into a commander as I go slowly? What is, so for example, if I have Richard right now at 24, but obviously I'm trying to get to 50, uh, what should be the progression chain? Like, should ah, I be order. working on one tree? The yeah. order of it? Yeah. I, I would say, um, so the bot's probably going to be a good, like, a good finishing tree. I would say in order, yeah. I would look at, um, 
so the top left, the chainmail, I believe it's called hold a line. That would probably be like the first thing I would go for. Yeah. Um, uh, another really good one is going to be like the little turtle shell on the bottom right. Um, so I, I go for that piece. Okay. Um, and then after that, it's going to be a little bit more according to like, you know, what your preferences are, but you might want to look for like loose formation, which is going to be like the three little waves at the bottom of the blue mm -hmm. tree. Um, and then you'd be looking to either A, um, go further in the blue tree or B, uh, get elite soldiers, which is the top of the red tree. Okay. Um, also that yield tree, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's pretty bad. I would double check with the bot just cause like I don't use, uh, uh, Yuji at all, but the the last one there, the like I believe it's like unrelenting force or something. Last in, um, I'm pretty sure that silences you, uh, which is like horrifically bad. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, can't okay. use that. Yes. Skills, yeah. Right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. This is something I was just told by someone in our uh, alliance. <laughs> this is good for open field slash sunset kingdom. So I just did it. I before I had basically elite soldiers, and then up to like the first of these four nodes right here and that's it yeah i would just i would just check with the bot because like i mean okay. i i in a general sense kind of know because even i i don't like i've homebrewed a couple talent trees for like specific like game commanders um right. but generally i just use the bot whatever is common knowledge is generally um i try not to reinvent the wheel too much <laughs> right oh also yeah another question in terms of like after kvk and when we do get um access to these other commanders and stuff should i continue using the same marches that i'm already like as a free to play player invested in or should i start looking into getting those other commanders like you know i keep hearing about how why she is very good and um once he's basically out then that's something a lot of people will be looking to invest in um and, and does that matter if i'm an archer player or not or i know? would i would not run archers uh in any i, I would go infantry if i were you and just go look for the infantry t5 and i would go you're probably you're basically richard sun Tzu until season of conquest like every sculpture you get until like kvk3 is probably just yep. gonna get, have to get saved because the way you'd have to invest um to get ysg you'd have to have um you'd have to like start and know exactly what you're doing basically um right. And, you know, you, the, the sculptures you've already put into Pyrrhus have, uh, like, greatly hampered your ability to invest in anything. So I would just, I'd stick to the Richard Sun Tzu. Maybe later you could have, like, a Sun Tzu Ethelflaed or, like, Sun Tzu with, like, some other commanders you have access to. Um, but okay. I, I would not worry about any comms until you get KVK3. At KVK3, you could shoot me a PM. I can just tell you whatever two comms are meta. I'll, I'll feed you two comms, and then, you know, you can, you can go on from there. But, like, I wouldn't worry about Legendary Gear. I wouldn't worry about Legendary Commanders. Just Richard Sun Tzu and okay, you know, yeah, yeah. Uh, and yeah, so you mentioned Richard. Um, trying to focus on hit leveling him uh, as a secondary commander. I know that like level thirty is what you would want to begin with to get all of the skills. But should I not also still be trying to level Sun Tzu just so he gets like increase in power as well? If you are so, for example, if you're doing like guardians and you can level like a bunch of different commanders. Um, yeah there's like there's no harm in putting extra xp there i would say if you're looking specifically for like other commanders that need xp right now i would say your gatherers do though um because your gatherers okay. have to be level 37 in order to right to get the max goals. right okay yeah. so i get all your gatherers to 37 if you get extra xp into sun Tzu, there's nothing wrong with that though um that's a fine choice okay cool all right well uh yeah i think that's pretty much it all right, man. It's it's been a pleasure. And if you have any other questions, just shoot me a PM. Don't be shy. Uh, you know, here for so sure. Yeah. Good job. All right, man. I, I will. Do, uh, do. Thanks. I'll see man. You Appreciate it. Yeah, of course. Good luck. Sure. I'll be lurking in your stream. <laughs> Bet. All right. All right see you around, man. Bye. All right. Oh no, no, that's not it. All right, boys, we're back. Oh. Camilo, ¿qué pasa? ¿Puedes hacer uh, entrenamiento en español? Ah, bueno. Yo puedo, lo puedo tratar, amigo. Porque ahora estoy un poco más, tengo un poco más confianza en mi español. Uh, pero me va a faltar mucho. Si, si no hablas como ningún chinguín de, de inglés, entonces va a ser algo muy difícil. Y eso es que yo tengo que hacer eso. Yo pienso, uh, tiene que hacer un, un entrenamiento privado. Y se va a hacer un poco más... Uh, 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 caro también, porque uh, privado es uh, 75 dólares, así que 
No que... Si era privado, yo lo pruebo. Pero en, en directo yo pienso que no. He's talking shit about us. <laughs> um, hey, 12, quick question. What would you recommend to make the main account a 24-hour KD get the chest and then migrate? Uh, yeah, that's not a bad idea. Discord for Discord. Si quieres, uh, puedes ir en en mi Discord y uh, hace un BF. Transition. He is not confident enough in his knowledge of Spanish game terms for Spanish coaching. Yes, that's especially he was saying. Uh, you know, do I? Uh, he's asking if I if I would do my Spanish in, uh my coaching in Spanish. I said it would have to be a private call and I would try it, but you know I, I wouldn't like. I would not stamp. I would not like guarantee the results, right? Like that. That's it'd be a, it'd be very far out of my comfort zone. It'd be difficult for me. Um, Twenty five consecutive days behind the fifty eight natives. I had to escape sixty six. Create my uh, fourteen days. How cooked am I? Uh, you're not that cooked. You seem fine. Would you pump resources for mania at your farms at twenty five? Uh, yeah, I did that. Can I do account coaching on mobile? You can. If you guys want your own uh, coaching sessions, you guys can always go to the Discord in the description below and make a ticket. I am not doing any more sessions right now. Uh, my next, uh, so I, I do two blocks of streaming. I start at 15 UTC, I end at 19 UTC, then I come back around 21 to 22 UTC, and I go for another four hours. So um, next block of, uh, of streaming, if you catch me around 22, 23 UTC, right when I start, before I pop my expansion, I'd be willing to do like one or two sessions. Um, but you have to catch me then. Uh, generally, if you guys buy on-stream coaching, you work around my schedule. And if you guys buy off-stream coaching, I work around your schedule. Can I win Zenith to two years of speeds? Uh, not unless your kingdom is like like two days old. Your kingdom has to be a like midget tier in order for that to happen. Okay. Would you restart for two tacos? Yes. When a new KD spawn at twenty thousand people i'm not entirely sure um uh, guys i am tired i'm tired i'm getting the fuck out of here um i'll be back later i need a break i need to, i need to like leave this house uh i i i streamed until like 1 30 a.m yesterday or one one o'clock or some shit and then i woke up at like 6 30 and started playing again i am freaking out my brain is exploding i'll be back in a few hours i'm gonna go get some coffee i'm gonna go right i'm gonna go touch grass and i'll be back in a few hours and i'll be streaming again okay so if you guys are waiting for me go to the discord in the description below go to the role selection tab turn on announcement and stream notifications i ping every single time i'm on i have to get the fuck out of here i love all of you guys An incredibly gateway i will be back turn on the stream notifications subscribe like notification bell we'll see you guys later okay love you guys deuces everybody take it easy bye bye y'all